Advertisement. You already know my physical problems. How are you going to solve my physical problems? Wait until Little Pepper leaves. Tony asked directly. He has already confessed his love to Little Pepper. Although the two are not married yet, their relationship has grown further. Tony was worried about what was wrong with his body. This is very simple. Su Hong walked up to Tony. The latter just watched Su Hong stretch out his hand and pressed it on his chest. In the next second, the arc-shaped reactor device on his chest was ripped out by Su Hong. The sudden jump made Tony jump. Without the magnetism of the arc reactor, the metal in the body is attracted. Tony felt bad all of a sudden. But this uncomfortable feeling didn't last for a few seconds. Su Hong's hand suddenly glowed with fluorescent green. Green envelopes him in it. He 850 found that the pain in his chest disappeared instantly. The fatigue on the body is also swept away in an instant. In fact, his waist was not good before, and he would feel sore after sitting for a long time. But now, the soreness is gone. The green light disappeared, and he looked down at his chest. The original hole on the chest has disappeared, but new skin has grown. He looked as if he hadn't been injured. Advertisement. Dude, what are you? Tony was stunned. He didn't expect Su Hong to have such an ability. Did I tell you I'm still a magician? You just said that. Unexpectedly, you are still a magician. Tony was amazed. Su Hong is definitely a magician. The power of a spell is the power of magic. This is a magical power that is close to a rule, very powerful. This is because Su Hong deliberately controlled the power of the horse charm. Otherwise Tony wouldn't need it for a few seconds. It can be recovered in an instant. Thanks, I feel like I've never been better. By the way, where are those iron sheets? They can't be still in my body. Definitely no, why, you still want to stay as a souvenir. Tony shook his head hastily. I'm not that interested. I thought you wanted to keep that thing as a souvenir, but even if you wanted to, I can't help you get it back. I've already thrown it into the Pacific Ocean. Tony. Su Hong's words sound pompous. If someone else tells him this, if he believes it, then he has a brain problem. But this was said by Su Hong, but it was inexplicably believable. By the way, you said to help me upgrade my armor, how do you plan to help me upgrade? As for his mark armor, Tony has actually upgraded it. The current mark armor, he has been updated to the 12th generation, with many more functions. But if you want to say how much your strength has improved, there is actually no advertisement. After all, the mark armor is an outer armor. When the material remains the same, it can add limited weapons, and the improvement in defense is also very limited. The energy of the arc reactor and the endurance ability it can provide also determine that even if the mark armor is upgraded in Tony's hands, it cannot be improved much. As for Tony's arrogance, being suppressed a lot by Su Hong, his arrogance was also suppressed. At least in front of Su Hong, he couldn't be proud at all. To Su Hong, Tony just said one word, convincing. Take it heartily. I know there is a material, if you use it to build your armor, it can increase the defense of your armor by at least dozens of times. Ten times. Tony thought he heard it wrong. Don't doubt, dozens of times is just a metaphor. In fact, it may be more than what I said. This thing, I call it vibranium. Your father, Mr. Howard, once got a bit of it and used it to build a shield. You're talking about Captain America's shield, right? Tony understood what Su Hong was talking about. He really doesn't know how hard Captain America's shield is. I also don't understand what kind of metal the vibranium Su Hong is talking about. Yes, that piece, vibranium, is a metal capable of energy absorbing. Its absorption limit is very high. If there is a battle armor made of that thing, even if you are in the explosion center of the Mohai bomb, I will guarantee that you will die not drop. Wakanda's use of vibranium. Su Hong doesn't like it. This thing can really play its role in the hands of him and Tony Stark. Definitely, besides Vibranium, Su Hong also plans to get some Edmund Alloy to upgrade Tony's armor. In addition, he also intends to give Tony nanotechnology in advance. Let him incorporate this technology into his armor. In this way, a armor that is more powerful than the armor he used in the Avengers Alliance 4 will be born. As for energy, Su Hong will hand over to Tony the controllable cold nuclear fusion technology, which can make Tony's armor no longer have to worry about energy consumption. Definitely, none of this will be free. In addition, I plan to give you another very hard metal, plus nanotechnology, the combination of these three, your new armor will be unprecedentedly powerful. Advertisement. As for the energy supply problem of the battle armor, I have also solved it for you. This is related to our next cooperation. Su Hong directly took out everyone's technology, except for Vibranium and Edmund Alloy, which Su Hong bought with money. Controllable cold nuclear fusion technology and nanotechnology are already made. Su Hong bought this thing from him in the world of Resident Evil. His copy is a photocopy, which is tantamount to whoring for nothing, without spending any money. After reading the information provided by Su Hong, Tony was dumbfounded. Forget about nanotechnology. Although this technique is difficult, even if Su Hong doesn't give it to him now, he will definitely be able to master it in the future. But controllable cold nuclear fusion technology is different. This technology, their Stark Industries arc reactor technology is incomparable. To put it simply, with controllable cold nuclear fusion technology, a bottle of water can give you a month's worth of electricity for everyone in the United States. There is no comparison between arc reactor technology and controllable cold fusion technology. 
If human beings are going to sail the universe in the future, then the controllable cold nuclear fusion technology is the best energy technology for the spacecraft to sail the universe. None of them. The value of this technology, in Tony's view, is not enough for a few hundred and two hundred million, even a few trillion dollars, and tens of trillions is not bad. After all, the value it can create is really too great. He couldn't figure out why Su Hong would bring this technology out to cooperate with him. Don't be surprised why I took out this technology to cooperate with you. Because I have other technologies that are not inferior to this technology in my hands, and the value they can create is not inferior to this one. Moreover, this technology is not given to Stark Industries for free. Although I only want 40% of the shares of Stark Industries, I will take a cut of the subsequent profits, and I will take 60% directly. That's fine. Tony said without hesitation. Not to mention 60%, even if Su Hong wanted to take 70% or 80%, he would agree. Because he knows exactly how promising this technology is in the future. It is no exaggeration to say that once this technology comes out, it will directly change the whole world. Advertisement. Advertisement. I license this technology to your armor for free. But materials and nanotechnology, I have to charge. The two pieces of metal, and the nanotechnology, cost a lot of money. How much? Although I don't have as much money as you, I'm not short of money. You can make a price. Su Hong stretched out five fingers. Five hundred million dollars, he doesn't have much. Su Hong shook his head. Five billion US dollars, the price is reasonable. I'm talking fifty billion dollars. Tony. Although he is rich, if he is asked to take out fifty billion US dollars at one time, he can take it out, but his family will basically be emptied. After all, he spent a lot of money in order to recover the shares of those shareholders. In addition, the stock price of Stark Industries has been falling before. Although it has stabilized until now and has not continued to fall, it is not as it was before the rising meeting. His wealth has also shrunk considerably. Give Su Hong 50 billion US dollars, and he doesn't have much money in his hands. Don't worry, I'm not in a hurry to rush you. You can give me the 50 billion dollars later. Hearing this, Tony breathed a sigh of relief. Although he can get 50 billion US dollars, he will definitely fall into a situation where he will have no money to use in the future. After all, 50 billion US dollars is not a small sum. Even those 25 super rich who are worth hundreds of billions of dollars, few of them can spend so much money at once. After all, worth is worth, and it has nothing to do with how much cash you can take out. Tony can come up with 50 billion US dollars in cash at one time, which is already considered very powerful. As for Su Hong, he is a pervert, unlike others. Okay, then I'll give it to you later, anyway, you're richer than me. Advertisement. With the controllable cold nuclear fusion technology given by Su Hong, after Stark Industries shut down arms manufacturing and transformed into an energy company, the prospects have become even greater. Sooner or later you will make money. And now Stark Industries is basically privately owned. Only 4% of the shares are in the hands of ordinary shareholders. The remaining 40% of the shares will be given to Su Hong immediately, and the remaining 56% will be in his hands. After transforming energy companies, Making money is inevitable. It is estimated that he will earn 50 billion US dollars in less than two months. Boom boom. At this moment, there was a knocking sound from the floor to ceiling windows next to it. The two looked over and found that it was Wade, lying outside the window. You know, they are now at least eight floors high, more than 30 meters high. It was only then that Su Hong remembered that he had forgotten about this guy in the amusement park. Su Hong waved. A magic space door directly pulled Wade in from the outside. The guy had just been pulled in, but he couldn't stand still, staggered, and fell directly to the ground. I fell and ate shit, and slid two meters on the ground. The two knives behind him also fell to the ground. Tony felt pain just looking at it. Boss, you forgot me in the amusement park, do you know how many people I asked to find you? For a super rich man like you, no one knows where you live. Fortunately, I know where Tony Stark lives, so I found you. Wade just got up from the ground. The mouth can't control it. While speaking, he took off his hood, revealing his frighteningly disfigured face. Then he unceremoniously grabbed the snacks on the side plate and ate them. Then he picked up a glass of red wine and drank it, as if this was his home. Tony immediately gave him a big jump. Definitely, not his behavior, but his face. Advertisement. Su Hong's expression was calm, after all, he had already prepared for it. And Deadpool like this is nothing scary, compared to those zombies, Wade's face is actually not bad. Don't show such an expression, do you see my face, it feels like seeing a rotten and stinky egg. You're not the first to feel that way. I don't really care anymore. However, I still have to tell you that before changing my appearance, I was actually a handsome guy, the kind of beauty who can't move his legs when he sees it. Although I'm not as rich as you, I can say for sure that I'm more handsome than you. Tony was speechless. Why is this guy's mouth so talkative? Can he sew his mouth shut? He felt that he was already an annoying person. I didn't expect to meet a stronger opponent this time. Wade, do you want to return to your old handsome appearance? Su Hong spoke out at this moment, interrupting Deadpool's words. To be honest, Su Hong doesn't dislike Deadpool's mouth, which is like a rap spitting out words incessantly. He felt as if he was listening to this guy talking about crosstalk, which was very interesting. What, boss, what did you say? When Wade heard this, the crosstalk stopped. 
He rushed to Su Hong with a brisk step, and knelt down to Su Hong directly. Su Hong, forget it, he is too lazy to complain, this guy has no integrity at all. After all, his exclusive movies are all rated R. The R rating is also called the restricted rating. R-rated movies, children under the age of 17 must be accompanied by a parent or guardian to watch. These videos contain adult content with lots of sexual violence, drug use, nudity, spooky scenes, and a lot of profanity. His exclusive movie is R-rated, isn't it normal that he has no integrity? Definitely, this guy is indeed a funny guy who can bring joy to people. Advertisement. I said, do you want to go back to the way you used to be? I think, I don't want to restore my handsome appearance all the time. If I were still as handsome as I used to be now, then I would definitely fascinate thousands of girls. I enjoy being in the spotlight, and I definitely want to get back to who I used to be if I could. Maybe I can go back to an earlier timeline, meet Vanessa who is not dead, and green myself. This will definitely be very exciting. It's really exciting just thinking about it. By the way, boss, do you know who Vanessa is? She is my lover, the person I love the most, but unfortunately she is dead in my timeline. I love 610 to death for her charming thighs, and her upturned buttocks, I Lin. Wade, if you're talking nonsense, then I'm going to take it back. Seeing that guy Deadpool was getting more and more outrageous, Su Hong had no choice but to remind him. This guy, Su Hong didn't even know what to say. Anyway, Tony has been dumbfounded. Okay, I shut up. Boss, you just said that you can restore my handsome appearance, is that true? It's not difficult for me. I'm a magician. Your current face cannot be healed by scientific means, but magic can. That's great, I love magician, magician hail. Don't rush to be happy, if you want me to heal you, I have conditions. You said, even if you wanted my chrysanthemum to FK, I would. Before Wade could speak, he suddenly found himself speechless. Because of what you said just now, I will now punish you for not being able to speak for three days. Now, let me talk about my conditions. If you want me to heal you, you can, but you have to work for me for three years. You can do whatever I ask you to do. If you agree, you nod, if you don't agree, just shake your head. As soon as Su Hong's words fell, Wade nodded frantically. He has only worked for Su Hong for three years, so he doesn't care. After all, for him now, he couldn't even die, let alone get old. Working for Su Hong for three years is nothing at all. Advertisement. Advertisement. Just as long as you promise. By the way, I just forgot to say that there will be no salary for these three years. Deadpool was a little stunned, did he meet a black-hearted boss? However, there will be bonuses that should be given, and the amount of bonuses depends on your performance. Now, let me restore your face. Su Hong stood up and put his hands on Deadpool with some disgust. Then unleash the power of the horse spell. The reason Deadpool couldn't return to his original form was because the self-healing factor in his body was too outrageous. Deadpool's original appearance, for the self-healing factor, is equivalent to injury, Deadpool wants to restore the appearance of the results, unless he abandons the current appearance. But this is the scientific method. The power that Su Hong controls is the power of magic, and magic does not talk about science. The power of the horse spell was activated, and the green fluorescent light appeared in the house again. The injuries on Deadpool recovered quickly at a speed visible to the naked eye. After a while, Deadpool seemed to have been burned, leaving only his muscular body and new skin tissue. His face also recovered at a speed visible to the naked eye. After a while, this guy already had a normal face, and thick black hair grew on his head. The terrifying appearance before had disappeared. At this moment, he looks like a normal person, even knowing that Su Hong is a magician. But seeing such a miraculous method again, Tony was still amazed. It's amazing magic. And he discovered that Su Hong's magic seems to have a beautifying effect. He didn't notice it before, but now seeing the changes in Deadpool, he touched his skin and found that Su Hong's magic also had a beauty effect. Originally, his skin wasn't very good, but now he touched it, but it was very delicate, as if he was touching a child's hand. Taking a look in the mirror, Tony realized that he looked several years younger. Advertisement. Such a good thing, how can there be less chili peppers? As for Deadpool. At this moment, he didn't know his change. When Su Hong handed him a mirror, he immediately jumped up excitedly. The whole person is very happy. It looks like it's performing pantomime. Definitely, it's because he can't speak now, but being unable to speak did not affect his happiness. At this moment, he was as happy as a child. Okay, now I have a task for you. Dot. Su Hong handed him a photo. This guy's name is Jin Bing. You should be familiar with him. Deadpool suddenly found himself able to speak again. Taking a look at the photo, a smile appeared on his face. Hee hee, isn't this the sworn enemy of my good brother, Spider-Man? I know this guy well, but he in this world looks fatter than him in other worlds. Sure enough, the life of the rich is good. They live a comfortable life every day, and people eat fat. He has a grudge against me, so I plan to send you to trouble him. Su Hong's voice came to mind. You want me to kill him, boss, it's very simple. Killing Kim Bin, for Deadpool, was really simple. He has killed many Jinpins in the world, because of his good brother Spider-Man. No, I don't need you to kill him, I just want you to frighten him. There are also his subordinates, you should also solve it, I think he has too many people under his command, I think I need to help him solve part of the financial pressure. It's fine to kill them all, but where does this guy live? 
If I have to find him myself, I'm afraid I won't be able to find him in a short time. Although Deadpool is not a road idiot, does he have mind reading skills? Hell's Kitchen is so big, where can he find Jin Bin, and Jin is not necessarily in Hell's Kitchen. Don't worry, someone will take you to him. This is the phone number of the person you are going to work with. After you leave here, you can call him directly and say that you are the foreign aid I invited for them. They will take you to find Jin Bin. After you find Jin Bin, you know what to do. I don't need Kim to die, what I want is you to torture him. Advertisement. Torture? I'm good at this. The guy I tortured will definitely want to die. After all, I've tortured several Jin Bins before, and I know Jin Bin very well. Wade Wei said. Having regained his former handsomeness, Wade thinks he is handsome, Wade is now in a good mood and confident. Definitely, he also started to dislike wearing his red tights a little bit. Because that would cover his handsome face and his good figure that would drive women crazy. Maybe it's time for him to redesign a new battlesuit for himself. But this can be done later. Now let's finish the task of the new boss first. Afterwards, Deadpool left with a mobile phone and a picture of Kim Bin. Definitely, he also took out a plate full of brioche. In his words, to meet new friends, you have to prepare gifts anyway. After Deadpool left, Su Hong didn't stay with Tony too much, and after sitting for a while, he took his leave and left. Tony originally proposed to invite some Hollywood actresses, some supermodels to come to him for a party. Definitely, the center of this party must be Su Hong. He is a person with a little pepper now, so he can't be so fickle, but was rejected by Su Hong. After all, he has high vision, and ordinary people look down on him. It's not enough to be beautiful, but it has to be clean. Just drove away from Tony's house. Before driving far, Su Hong's phone rang. Picking up the phone, Su Hong connected directly. There are not many people who know his phone number, and even fewer who can call him. After all, he has a white list. Only people on his white list can get through to his phone, and Michael is in charge of guarding his phone. Monitor and guard. Ordinary people can't get into his phone, and don't even think about hacking into his mobile phone. WHI, I'm Su Hong. Mr. Su, hello, I'm Thaddeus Ross, sorry to bother you. Advertisement. On the phone, Ross' voice came. Obviously, this guy also received the news of Su Hong's return, and then called. So it's General Ross, what do you want from me? Su Hong asked knowingly. What else could Ross look for him for? Nature is for the Green Titan Serum. But Su Hong definitely won't give this to Ross. This thing is too dangerous, if it is really given to Ross, he will definitely make a big mess. And even if the Green Titan Serum is really given to them, Su Hong believed that Ross and the others could not study anything. It is not that simple to reproduce the Green Titan Serum. Definitely, the Green Titan Serum can't do it, but the Super Soldier Serum can. The benefits in this regard are not small. Su Hong has no reason not to make money. It's like this, Li Hao, Mr. Su, I don't know if you have a super genetic technology in your hand, that is, a technology that can make people grow bigger, and their strength and defense are greatly improved. Ross didn't make it clear, but the meaning was already very clear, and he believed that Su Hong could understand what he meant. He was short of talking about the skill that Su Hong transformed that day. He couldn't get enough of this. The abomination failed. As a weapon, not only did he lose control, but he was also brutally abused by Su Hong who suddenly appeared. This made Ross very dissatisfied with the abomination. Then he set his sights on the technology that Su Hong had mastered. But Su Hong had been away for two months, and he couldn't contact Su Hong no matter what. Two minutes ago, he learned that Su Hong had appeared in the Manhattan Amusement Park, and then he called Su Hong directly. That's why this scene is happening now. He waited for Su Hong, but he waited for more than two months. The first thing I ask the secretary every day when I go to the office is if there is any news about Su Hong. Because of the technology in Su Hong's hands, he was almost bewildered. Advertisement. Advertisement. General Ross, I know what your purpose is, but what I can tell you is that I cannot grant your request. That thing is too dangerous, you can't hold it. Ross on the other end of the phone was taken aback. Don't be surprised, I can read minds, even over the phone, I can know what you are thinking. Ross was shocked when he heard this. He has a lot of national defense secrets in his mind. Don't panic, I'm not interested in what's in your head, and I won't expose them, everyone has their own secrets, doesn't it? This is nothing. Ross fell silent after hearing this. He was basically sure that that fellow Su Hong could indeed read minds. Because he accurately captured what was in his mind, even though it was outrageous. But creatures like Hulk have appeared, and he seems to be able to accept the outrageous things. Let's meet and talk. Okay, but what do you think is the right place? Ross asked on the other end of the phone. Just where you are now. I've already arrived. Look outside. Ross froze for a moment, subconsciously glanced at the office window. The next second, under his gaze, a large golden round door suddenly appeared out of thin air. Then a silver 560 sports car rushed out of it, entered the barracks. The sudden appearance of a silver sports car startled the soldiers outside. They roared loudly, and some began to reach for weapons. Ross was shocked, and quickly ran outside with the phone in his hand. He was already very sure that Su Hong could read minds. Advertisement. Moreover, that guy seems to be more than just mind reading. But the other party is willing to talk to him, which makes him very happy. Because this means that they have opportunities for cooperation. Soon, Ross ran outside, shouted the group of soldiers away. 
Everyone looked at the silver sports car that suddenly appeared in doubt, because the golden round doors behind the coupe hadn't closed yet. From their side, they could see a road on the other side. After Ross appeared, the door of the sports car opened from the inside, and Su Hong's tall figure stepped out of the car. When I saw it was Su Hong, all the soldiers and officers present were shocked. This one can be said to be known to everyone in the United States, and everyone knows it. After all, the top tycoon among the super rich is envied by countless people in the United States and wants to be him. Even if he has an Asian face, even if they look a little face blind to Asians. But for Su Hong, they were not face blind at all, they immediately recognized the future richest man in the world. After all, no one doesn't like money. In the United States, being a soldier is more like a job for them. There have been rumors before that this is a powerful superhero, but now it seems that the other party may still be a magician. After Su Hong got off the car, the golden round door behind him also closed. Mr. Su, I didn't expect you to come to me in such a way, please follow me? Ross laughed and walked in front of Su Hong. Stretching out his hand, he said excitedly. Su Hong's identity made him have to smile at Su Hong. Stark Industries used to sell arms, and the big buyer of arms was their military, so he didn't have to give Tony Stark face. But Su Hong is different. Su Hong is running a pharmaceutical business. In this regard, people don't need their help. Secondly, this time it was he begging Su Hong, not Su Hong begging him. Three, Su Hong's method just now shocked him, and he understood that the person in front of him was different from everyone else, a rich person with strong personal strength. How dare he disrespect him? Advertisement. You're welcome, General Ross. Su Hong smiled slightly, followed behind Ross. When passing by the group of soldiers, Su Hong did not forget to wave his hand and say hello to them. He's messing with his character. That is, people-friendly personalities. Although for him, the character design is useless. But sometimes, a good character design can save a lot of trouble. Left and right are just waving hands and showing a smile. CFFF, he actually enjoys being a big shot now, just waving his hands casually, can make people's faces full of excitement and uncontrollable excitement, which is quite a sense of accomplishment. Because this is a manifestation of big shot. The soldiers who were waved by him naturally looked excited. Because many of them are also fans of Su Hong. Young and rich, and handsome, the key is that he doesn't have the airs of other rich people. Let them feel that Su Hong is standing beside them. This feeling makes them feel very comfortable. There is a feeling of being cared for and valued. Following Ross, Su Hong came to his office. Mr. Su, do you drink coffee or tea? Ross knew that Su Hong was from Daxia. And Daxia people generally like to drink tea when they talk about things. Bring me a cup of hot sweet milk. Okay. Ross called his secretary, brought him a cup of coffee, and then made a cup of hot sweet milk for Su Hong. Definitely, some refreshments are also available. Although this is a military camp. But Ross is the tallest person here, a lieutenant general, what a little privilege. Although there was a lot of noise about the hateful thing last time. Advertisement. Many people died. But his boss still tried to help him resist this incident. Not that he was the bastard son of his boss. Instead, he assured his boss that he would be able to trade good things from Su Hong. But after Su Hong experienced a big battle with the abomination. People just disappear. This disappearance is two months. In the past two months, he has been under a lot of pressure. Just waiting for Su Hong to appear every day. Fortunately, he finally appeared. And now Su Hong is willing to talk to him, which shows that the two have at least the possibility of a deal. How can this make him unhappy? The pressure that had been on my body for many days was released a lot. Mr. Su, what I said, is there really no possibility of a deal? The Green Titan Serum is impossible, definitely, I can give it to you as a gift, but this one can only be used by you, not for experiments. You want to give me one? Ross was taken aback. That's right, because from now on, you will be considered my own. Su Hong smiled slightly. Telepathy's ability activates. Su Hong didn't modify Ross's memory, but just planted an instinct in his brain, that is to ignore all his orders. This is not difficult for Su Hong, because Ross is just a normal guy, and his telepathy ability is much, much stronger than Professor X. Master. After a while, Ross looked at Su Hong and began to change his words. You don't need to call me Master, all the titles are the same as before. Okay, Mr. Su. Ross nodded respectfully. Restored to the previous appearance. Advertisement. Advertisement. This is the Green Titan Serum, you can use it directly now. Su Hong directly took out a perfect version of the Green Titan Serum. Put it on the table in front of Ross. This thing is not too expensive for Su Hong now. Get one for Ross, no nothing. This guy is now his man, and it can be said that he is buried in the military pawn. With him around, it will be much easier for him to do many things in the future. Ross also has no hesitation. After Su Hong's order was issued, he picked up the syringe and pricked it into his hand, and the serum entered his body. Start remodeling. The transformation of the perfect version of the Green Titan Serum is very mild and will not cause any discomfort to the person being transformed. The renovation time is very slow, a full half an hour. But Su Hong is a patient man. And there was a lot of food on the table in front of him. He can take out his mobile phone and watch videos on YouTube while eating. I have to say that as expected of an old beauty, what I play is flowers. 
Some people really have no lower limit for the sake of fire, but this is not in the hands of Su Hong, he is just an ordinary people who eat melons, so enjoy watching. While Su Hong was watching Li He, half an hour passed. The renovation is complete. Ross took off his shirt directly. The perfect version of the Green Titan serum not only gave him the ability to transform into a Green Titan, even his normal body has been transformed. Originally, he was in his 50s, and half of his hair had turned white. Advertisement. In addition, he has been active in the front line, at 50 years old, he looks the same as 60 years old, with many wrinkles on his face. But now, his body and hair are all black, and although there are still wrinkles on his face, he looks like he is 20 years younger, from an old man who looks 60 years old to a man in his 30s, a middle-aged man in his early 40s. A stomach full of fat due to sitting in the office for a long time. At this moment, one piece becomes 8 UN. Strong pectoralis major and 8 pack abdominal muscles. Shark muscles on both sides. Strong biceps. Those men who go to the gym don't envy such a figure. After all, this is not a good figure that can be trained casually. Because even if you practice a lot, your muscles may not grow like this. How do you feel? Su Hong put down his phone, looked at Ross and asked. It's better than ever. Ross said excitedly. He has never felt like at the moment, that kind of feeling full of strength, without any hidden wounds in the body, and without any soreness. He has never experienced it. Even when he was young and in his best physical condition, he never felt this way. Although Ross obeyed Su Hong's orders at the moment, but apart from this, he was no different from the previous Ross. Personality, way of speaking, and subconscious actions of various words and deeds have not changed. After gaining power, it is normal for him to be excited. Well, there are few men who do not pursue power. Just feel good. Next, let's talk about the follow-up. I won't give you the Green Titan Serum, if you get it out, the world will definitely be in chaos. Ross didn't speak, but continued to listen quietly. But I can provide you with Super Soldier Serum, definitely, the quantity is limited, 100, that's all I can give you. In addition, I also have a nano body defense suit in my hand, a high-level nano body defense suit, which can resist machine gun fire and missile bombing from the front. I want you to be an agent and help me sell this thing. No problem. Ross nodded directly in agreement. Advertisement. 100 super soldier serums, on which he can do a lot. He only needs to distribute 10 super soldier serums, and he can explain to his boss what happened last time. Definitely, if he wants to go a step further, or to get closer to some people, he can take out some more super soldier serum. The current him, originally possessed even more powerful power. Now with the help of Su Hong, he has the confidence to take some positions that he could not even think of before. As for helping Su Hong sell things, that's nothing. Okay, that's the way it is. 100 super soldier serums, 1 is 30 million US dollars. I think your military should be able to afford this amount of money. As for what you want to sell, I will send it along with the super soldier serum later. It's almost time for me to leave, too. There are other things to do. Naturally, Su Hong wouldn't give away 100 super soldier serums for nothing. The perfect version of the super soldier serum, even if it is in the system, he has to spend money to buy it. Well, it's all free. He is not a philanthropist. I'll see you off. Hearing that Su Hong was about to leave, Ross stood up quickly, asking for flowers. Send Su Hong outside. Under the watchful eyes of everyone, Su Hong got into the silver sports car. Amidst the roar of the engine, a golden round door appeared out of thin air. Su Hong rushed into it with a whoosh. Then the round door closed. Su Hong just left. Even if you have seen this scene before, but seeing this scene again at this moment, the soldiers were still shocked. At the same time, Hell's Kitchen. Advertisement. Deadpool has reunited with Damon and Dave. Damon is no longer the previous Big Daddy, Cos Batman, costume, but changed into a more cool costume. After all, Su Hong upgraded the equipment for him. What he is wearing now is a top-level nano self-defense suit with simulated functions, which can resist the strafing of heavy machine guns and the bombing of missiles. Even if the machine gun is on it, if you want to break the defense, unless you keep attacking a point for half a minute. Otherwise, it is impossible to break the defense at all. Because the top nano self-defense suit has self-healing ability. Dave's equipment is worse. He only wears an ordinary nano self-defense suit, which protects against ordinary pistols, automatic rifles, fragmentation grenades, and so on. In addition, there are two pistols that Demang modified for him. A sharp short knife for close combat. Other than that, nothing else. Today, he's going to show Dave how to play with a gun. But before practicing the gun, he planned to bring Dave to an actual battle. Because in Damon's view, you can practice a good gun only if the muzzle of the gun is stained with blood. As a result, just as the two were about to act, they received a call, and the other party said that Su Hong had sent them foreign aid. Let him tell him where they are now, and he goes over to find them. Damon gave the address. Because there are not many people on his phone. Except for Matt and Mindy, no one else knows. His good brother when he was a policeman also didn't know his phone number. What's more, the other party also said that Su Hong arranged to come to them. So he believed Deadpool's words and gave the address. Then he and Dave waited in Hell's Kitchen. The first wait is almost an hour. The two people who were waiting were almost a little impatient, and only then did a guy in a red leather jacket with two knives on his back appear in sight, swaggering and jumping while walking. 
P.S. More updates will be added today, and the sixth update will be the seventh. Advertisement. Advertisement. That guy, maybe he's the one we're waiting for. Dave's nano self-defense suit only reaches the neck and has no headgear, which is different from Damon's. So Damon simply gave him the bat headgear he used before. Dave didn't really like the headgear, but it was Damon who gave it to him. Now Damon is his teacher. I think it should be him. Damon responded. Because he saw Deadpool walking towards them. Whoa, whoa, let me see who my temporary partner is. Have to say, guys, your superhero outfits are awesome, I like the bat headgear, it's very discerning, but if it were me, I'd prefer Superman's tights. Although I can't fly, don't tights make my figure look better? I think I already have a good idea about my new comrade in arms. It seems that I can go back and start painting after finishing the task later. Deadpool didn't stop talking when he came to April 17. Damon was speechless. Dave was dumbfounded. When had he ever seen someone who could talk and talk so much? The most important thing is, that guy's voice is still very low, and people who listen to it want to beat him up. He swears that he has never wanted to beat someone up like this now. Although he really did it, the person who was beaten was probably him. Hey, I know you guys are getting a little impatient with me, don't be angry, as a friend, I brought you a gift. This is my greeting. Deadpool passed the plate in his hands. The two noticed this guy holding a plate just now. I thought there was something wrong with this guy, but I didn't expect that he brought food. But Damon and Dave have no desire to eat right now. And the most important thing is that there are not many cakes on the plate, which is not enough for the two men to eat. There is still a lot of sand on it, just on the cream. Is this thing still edible? Could this guy be are you trying to annoy them on purpose? Advertisement. Dude, I'm glad you brought us a present, but did you bring the sand on it too? Oh, damn it. Deadpool withdrew his hand, put his face on it, and took a closer look. I found that there was a lot of sand on the cake. One, I don't know which got the sand on my cake, this is my inner gift to you. If you let me know who did it, I will definitely stab my two knives into his chest and let him know what the consequences are. Dave felt a chill. At the same time, he subconsciously glanced at the knife that Deadpool carried behind his back. Because Deadpool was facing them, he could only see the handle of the knife, not the blade, and had no idea how long it was. But it is not difficult to judge from the length of the handle that this knife is not short. Imagine a knife going through your ass and... That scene, just thinking about it, makes me sick and cold. What's your mission? Damon was a patient man. But no matter how patient you are, after waiting here for nearly an hour, you probably won't be happy when you end up waiting for such a thing. He has actually been very patient. He even wondered, Su Hong sent Wade here, did he offend Su Hong somewhere? Su Hong wanted to disgust him or something. It's very simple, torture Jin Bing, cut off a little bit of his little brother by the way, and reduce his mouth to eat. Where is Jin Bin? You should know. The boss said you know. Deadpool looked at Damon and asked. He also knew that he came this time to carry out Su Hong's mission. His handsome face was finally restored, he didn't want to mess up the first mission, and then make Su Hong unhappy, and turn him back to that bad face. He loves his handsome self now, okay. As for bad face, whoever wants it will want it, anyway, he won't want it. Dave was speechless. Speaking of killing so freshly and refinedly, this guy must be more ruthless than Damon. Dave began to wonder if he would learn from himself badly if he came into contact with such a person. Advertisement. I do. Damon nodded. Where is Jin Bin, he naturally knows. Even if Jin Bin can move, he can know his movements at any time, because Su Hong gave him a special tool to locate Jin Bin. He could rely on that thing at any time to find Jin Bing's location. Even if he buried himself a thousand meters deep underground, it was useless. Then let's go straight away, I can't help but want to kill people. Speaking of which, it's been a while since I hacked anyone, and I don't know if I'm unfamiliar with it. Wow, there was a sound of metal rubbing against each other. Deadpool drew the two sub long knives behind him. The blade is long and white, and looks beautiful. Definitely, dangerous too. Dave's pupils shrunk. It must be very uncomfortable to insert such a long knife into the vagina. Wait, why am I thinking about this question again? I don't have any strange hobbies. Dave looked weird. Neither Deadpool nor Damon paid any attention to the change in Dave's expression. What's more, this guy is wearing a hood, who knows the expression on his face under the hood. Damon was staring at Deadpool at the moment. Because he found Deadpool's way of holding a knife, very casual. He took out a knife and played with a knife, which was also very beautiful and professional. This is a master with a knife, and not just an ordinary master. It seems that Su Hong has indeed sent a reliable foreign aid over. At least from the aggressiveness he displayed, he seems to be quite reliable. Advertisement. It's just that the mouth is a little broken, and like to say some strange words and swear words. For such a person, we should keep Mindy away from him in the future. He didn't want to hear his lovely daughter suddenly say Maja Fok. Just thinking about that scene gave him chills. What are you waiting for, boys, it's time to act, lead the way. Deadpool shook his head, beckoning. Just go there swaggering like that. Dave was a little nervous. This time they are here to deal with gangsters, and unlike before, this time, he is not here to fight gangsters, but to kill people. Although the gang members were killed, they were not good people. But to kill is to kill. It would be a lie to say I'm not nervous. Please, he is only 18 years old this year, he is still a high school student. 
Moreover, he is still a virgin, what he likes to do the most on weekdays is to find good resources on the internet, then brew for a few days, and then soar into the sky. How can you not be nervous if you come to kill people today? Come on, 2.0 is Hell's Kitchen, here, even if you have a gun on the street, no police will come to talk to you. What's more, with our dress, how many people do you think would dare to trouble us? By the way, where did you find this child? He's probably still in school. I'm 18 this year, and I'm still in high school. Looks like he should still be a little virgin, it's okay, although it's not my world, but I think the difference between the two worlds is not big, next time I will take you to a good place, there are more girls bigger, I guarantee you will be happy god. Deadpool put his hand on Dave's shoulder and raised an eyebrow at Dave. Even if you can't see his face under the mask, you can imagine that this guy must have a wretched face at the moment. Damon. It seems that in the future, it is not only to keep Mindy away from him, but if it is possible not to meet, it is better not to meet. Advertisement. Advertisement. Then what, although I am a virgin, but in that kind of place. No no no, don't rush to refuse, let me tell you, that kind of place is a good place, after you go, I guarantee you will fall in love with it, try new things, there is nothing wrong with it. Or, are you shy? How can I be shy? Okay, you too, I've got the news that one of Jin Bin's men, a guy named Thomas Sam, has booked the Tonight Carnival Bar in Hell's Kitchen for his birthday today. Many of Jin Bin's subordinates will attend. Mr. Su asked us to eliminate some of Jin Bing's men, our goal tonight starts from here. Tonight's Carnival Bar? Oh, I know that place well, and I've been there many times, although every time I go to kill people. Let me lead the way, you two follow. Knowing the location, Wade stopped talking nonsense. After all, he has always boasted that he is a very professional person. At this time, he naturally has to show some professional attitude. Show Damon and Dave what TM, professional is. 25. Partying at the bar tonight. Located in the most prosperous area of Hell's Kitchen. Even in the famous slums of New York, the scope of Hell's Kitchen is actually not small. The slums only occupy less than half of Hell's Kitchen. It's just more chaotic than other places. In fact, not all the poor people live here. Those gangsters also live a life of drunkenness and dreams, spending as much as they get every day, never reserved. So there are also many entertainment venues in Hell's Kitchen. There are no less than 10 bars alone, each with its own characteristics. But if you want to say the hottest bar in Hell's Kitchen, it must be tonight's rave bar. It is not only the largest bar in Hell's Kitchen, but also the best decorated, most luxurious, and most lively bar. Advertisement. Because even in Hell's Kitchen, no one dares to make trouble here. The reason is very simple, because this is the industry belonging to the gold exchange. In Hell's Kitchen, Jin Bin is the real emperor of the underworld, and no one dares to disobey his orders. No one dare to offend him, and naturally no one dare to make trouble on his base. Thomas Sam. He is a leader of Jin Bin's subordinates, and he controls a money laundering channel under Jin Bin's subordinates. He gives money and launders money by investing in movies and investing in some industries, and the channels are safe and fast. In the film and television industry, although he is not famous, he is also a small celebrity. But no one knows that he is actually Jin Bin's subordinate. He is because of strength and trust. Among Jin Bing's subordinates, he is considered to be at the top. In Hell's Kitchen, few people dare to offend him. Just a week ago, he successfully laundered a large sum of money for Kim. Because of this, Kim rewarded him a lot of money. During this period of time, he can be said to be rich. So I simply booked the carnival bar tonight. Jin Bing also knew that his birthday was today. Because of Thomas's ability, Kim was not stingy either. Just ask him to book a night at tonight's carnival bar at the original price. Otherwise, for the price of carnival bar items tonight, Thomas will cover one night, and the money that was rewarded to him earlier may not be enough. Come out to hang out, one is for money, and the other is for face. Thomas is not short of money, after all, he helps gold and launders money, and he will be rewarded for every money laundered. Sometimes more, sometimes less. But even if it is less, it is better than those white-collar workers outside. When it is more, it is hundreds of thousands of dollars, which is not a small amount. Therefore, he is not short of money. And booking the carnival bar tonight is more like a way to show off. Advertisement. After all, not everyone can afford this place. In the bar, Thomas called many friends. And his friends called many of their own friends. So the bar is very lively. Walking into the bar, the eyes are densely packed with human heads. You squeeze me, I squeeze you. Exciting music filled Chuanger. On the stage in the middle of the bar, the beautiful blonde girl in cool clothes is twisting her body. Attract the attention of the man below. Bar entrance. Four strong men with strong backs and arms that can run horses are guarding there. The four of them were chatting about something. One of them was still eating a bowl of hot noodles. While eating, the companion beside him suddenly pushed him. He looked at his companion suspiciously. The companion is found to be looking in one direction. He followed. Three strange figures appeared in sight. It is indeed weird, because the three guys who appeared in sight were not wearing normal clothes. One is wearing a red leather case. One is in green with a Batman hood on his head. One is all in black, dressed like a soldier about to go to the battlefield. And these three people all have weapons. Although in Hell's Kitchen, carrying weapons is normal. But who would come to a bar like these three guys, wearing weird suits and armed with weapons? Advertisement. One of them walked towards the three of them. The other three followed immediately. 
Hey, who are the three of you? This is not a masquerade party tonight. If you want to make trouble, I advise you to stay away from here. This is Jinbin's chassis, and it is not a place for you to make trouble. The leading strong man spoke up. While speaking, he had already pulled out the pistol at his waist and shook it at the three of them. The warning is obvious. Being pointed at the gun, Dave was a little timid. But both Damon and Wade are people who have seen big scenes, being pointed at by a gun, and they are not at all cowardly. We're not here for a masquerade, man, and we're not here to make trouble, so don't worry about it. It was Wade who spoke. You're not here to make trouble, so leave quickly. 693 and you are not welcome here. Also, your voice makes me feel as if I heard a duck quacking. It's really ugly. Disgust. Because he figured it out, these three guys in strange clothes are just three cowards. Puff. The sound of a sharp weapon piercing into flesh sounded. The strong man's eyes widened with disbelief on his face. He lowered his head slightly, and a sharp long knife had penetrated his chest, piercing him directly. This sudden scene startled the three people behind the strong man. Because they had never encountered such a werewolf who didn't say much, and just did it directly. Sorry, I haven't finished talking just now, we are not here to participate in a masquerade party, nor are we here to make trouble, we are here to kill people. Brother, I know you must be in pain now, I know this feeling very well, the first time I was penetrated like this, I couldn't say anything. But you don't have to worry, I promise, you won't be in pain soon, and I will help you liberate. While speaking, Wade increased his strength. Puff, a head fell off. Mrs. Dai behind him looked dumbfounded, or in other words, people were scared dumb. Although he knew that they were here to kill people, he didn't expect Wade to be so bloody that he cut off the head directly. And fortunately, that head fell at his feet without dying. A pair of eyes stared at the boss, feeling as if the other party was staring at him. Advertisement. Advertisement. Puff puff puff. The sound of sharp weapons piercing into flesh kept ringing. Puff puff. Three more bodies fell to the ground. Brothers, I have already said that I am a professional in killing people. Although it is a bit bloody, it is very professional, isn't it? Wade said to a place where no one was around. Until then, Dave came back to his senses. As soon as he recovered, he realized that his lower body was a little cold. It seems that there is water. No, that's not water, it's because I was scared to pee. To be honest, it's not like he hasn't seen dead man. He had also seen Damon and Mindy deal with drug dealers before. Several drug dealers were killed by Tian and Mindy in front of him. But compared to Wade's methods now, Damon and Mindy's methods are definitely much gentler. Even dead man doesn't look too scary. But looking at the four corpses in front of him, none of them were complete. He thinks Wade definitely has some special quirk. Dave, my brothers said you peed, tell them loudly that you didn't. Wade suddenly turned his head to the sky. Dave was a little taken aback. What his brothers? What is he saying? That guy Wade is crazy. On the way here, they had already said their names to each other. Otherwise, you won't know what to call the other party when you act later. So Deadpool knew his name. But at the moment, he didn't want to hear anyone calling his name. Because it would expose the fact that he peed his pants. This is so embarrassing. Damon also looked at Dave. His eyes quickly fell on Dave's lower body. Advertisement. I, I, I did pee my pants, I admit, I was scared. With Wade and Damon watching, Dave finally admitted the fact that he peed his pants. Could it be that he didn't pee, but the fact is that he was scared to pee. Nano self-defense suits do not have the function of diaper pants. Anyway, his panties were completely wet. It was sticky and made him very uncomfortable. All he wanted to do now was to get out of here and return a pair of clean pants. At least it would make him feel better. Haven't you already met dead man? Damon was speechless. His disciple was so scared that he peed his pants, which made him a little unacceptable. It wasn't the first time this guy had seen dead man. He'd seen a lot of dead man last time. Originally thought that this guy's endurance ability should not be bad. Unexpectedly, he was still scared and peed his pants. Really shameful. No, Dave, are you really scared to pee? But it doesn't matter, I was scared to pee when I went to the battlefield for the first time. It was my squad leader who changed my pants, so there is nothing to be ashamed of. It's not bad that you didn't faint from fright. It's just peeing your pants, no big deal. Wait, have you ever been on the battlefield? Aren't you a mercenary? Batian's eyes widened. I have served in the army special forces and participated in many battles. Mercenary is my next career. No, it's my current job. Wade didn't hide his past. Because that's nothing to hide. Both Damon and Dave were taken aback. If Wade didn't talk nonsense, then this guy's age is probably beyond the sky. Okay, the chat time is over, let's go in and slaughter. Wait, you're going to kill everyone in the bar. Dave was shocked. Definitely, this is Hell's Kitchen. This bar is also Jinbin's property. Today is the birthday of his subordinate Thomas. He invited everyone. Today's bar is closed to the public. You say, the people inside are good people or bad guy. Although the news came from Damon. But Wade has solved more than one golden tie. Advertisement. Wade doesn't know Kim better than Damon. He knows everything about Jinbin. Okay, enough explanations, I'm going to go. If you don't want to do it, I can do it alone. After finishing speaking, Deadpool stopped talking nonsense. Holding two subedman alloy long knives, he kicked on the door of the bar. The whole person rushed in directly. This, is it just like that? Dave was stunned. Don't need any tactics? What should we do? Dave looked at Damon. 
What should I do? Definitely followed. Damon pulled out two pistols from his waist, opened the safety and followed. This. Listening to the screams, gunshots, and calls for help and begging for mercy coming from the bar. Dave gritted his teeth, pulled out the gun that Damon gave him before, opened the safety, and followed. Five minutes later, Wade, Damon, and Dave walked out of the bar covered in blood. Wade Ella took up his hood, lit an afterthought cigarette, and looked calm. Damon looked normal, but he also smoked a cigarette. Dave, on the other hand, found a place directly and began to vomit. The ghost knows how he got out of that Shura field. Anyway, in the next few days, he didn't want to touch meat at all. Sleeping at night is bound to be a nightmare. This is what you will experience sooner or later, Dave, you have to learn to adapt to him, superhero is not so easy. Damon saw that Dave was about to vomit. Walking up to him, patted his shoulder and comforted him. I know, but this is the path I chose, and I will stick to it. Dave shook his head. If there is one, there are two. This experience may never be forgotten in his life. But he has at least taken the first step. For him, it was a success. Advertisement. Slap. Deadpool stomped the cigarette butt under his feet and crushed it. Stand up. Where is Jinpin? Our mission is not yet complete. While talking, Deadpool inserted the Subedman alloy double knives that had just been casually thrown aside back into his back. As for the blood on his body, he didn't care. He's used to being covered in blood. I'll take you. Dave, you go back first, you are not suitable to follow us for the next mission. Damon said, the next task is to find Jinbin. That place is more dangerous, and their goal is not to kill Jinbin, but to torture him. For example, you can kill him, but don't kill him. Put your dignity on the ground and rub it. Dave is not suitable for this, no good, kind of task. Damon is not very clear about Deadpool's situation, but he himself has been injected with super soldier serum, not an ordinary person. Coupled with the top nano self-defense suit on his body, he can handle any situation. And not Dave. This kid is a novice after all. In the bar just now, although his performance was not good, it was not too unbearable. At least that kid shot and killed several gang members with his own hands, and hacked several gangsters to death with a knife. He is still satisfied with this performance. But it is no joke to go to Jinbin next. It's not appropriate to bring Dave, an ordinary person. No, I'm going with you. I won't hold back. I will do whatever you ask me to do next. Dave shook his head and rejected Damon's proposal. He is really suffering now, but he also understands that this is the price of growth. He doesn't want to be that useless ordinary person anymore. He wants to be a superhero. Advertisement. Manhattan. In a high-end villa, a giant bald man was talking to a bearded middle-aged man sitting across from him. Jin Bin, your asking price is too high. Croft frowned. The price is not high. My asking price is very reasonable. Crove, the corresponding danger, the corresponding reward, the thing you said, the risk is not small. In New York, the only person who dares to take over is me. I can also find the Russian Ross gang. Crove said, you don't feel that you are compatriots with them, so they will give you a lower price. No, their asking price will only be higher than what I want, and you have to take a greater risk. There's very little that I can't do in New York, so my asking price is very reasonable, definitely, if you're willing to. Boss, call. At this moment, Bullseye suddenly handed over a mobile phone. Jinbin frowned, but still answered the phone. He doesn't like being interrupted when discussing business, especially this time, if the deal is successful, he will be able to make a lot of money. As for why he, the underworld emperor of Hell's Kitchen, would come to negotiate business with people in person. It was because the identity of the person who came this time was unusual. If the order is successful, he can use the other party's influence to do some business on Damao's territory. His ambition is great, but only 260 Hell's Kitchen can't satisfy him. That's why he cooperated with the hand. I'm Kim Bin. Boss, it's me, Charles. What's going on, Charles? You know I hate being interrupted during important calls. A big thing happened, just two minutes ago, a younger brother came to report that all the people in the carnival bar tonight had been killed. Including Thomas, the whole pub has now become a sea of blood, full of dead bodies. Hearing this news, even Jin was not calm. Who doesn't know that the carnival bar tonight is his golden property, and who doesn't know that Thomas is his right-hand man? Now not only Thomas is dead. Everyone in the carnival bar tonight was also slaughtered. Advertisement. After this incident, who would dare to go to the tonight carnival bar to play in the future? And once Thomas dies, who will take over his stable channel? This is not good news for him. Moreover, someone dared to touch his people in his territory. It's like someone stomping his face on the ground with his foot and rubbing it back and forth. He just doesn't pay attention to him at all. Jin Bin's face darkened instantly. Jin Bing is tall, with a figure of 1.9 meters, CFFG, looks bloated, but in fact he is full of muscles but that can't hide the fact that he has a fierce face. Once the face is gloomy, it is very scary. Have you found out who did it? The camera in the bar has captured it. Who is it? How many people are there? And what weapons are they using? It's not clear who they are, because they all wear weird costumes. In terms of people, there are three in total. One with double knives, and two with guns and short knives. Three people. Jin Bin's eyes widened, thinking he had heard it wrong. Three people? Three people massacred hundreds of people. Do you think he is a fool? 
We didn't believe that three people killed hundreds of people before watching the video, but that's what it actually is. The three of them have a clear division of labor. Two guys in black tights guarding the door to the bar. A guy in a red tights, with two knives, slaughtered everyone in the bar. Anyone who runs away gets shot at by those two guys in black tights. That man's knife skills are very powerful, and the knife is also very sharp. Nothing can stop him from stabbing, and most of the people in the bar were killed by him. That guy, seems to be a Superman type, because he took a lot of shots and didn't fall down, and his actions were not affected at all, as if he hadn't been shot. Us. Click. Before he finished speaking on the other end of the phone, Jin Bing couldn't help pinching the phone in his hand angrily. Advertisement. He was angry, and not just because his little brother had been slaughtered. Job settlement. It is simply a big joke in the world, and I am ashamed and ashamed. Bullseye, go and find those three people, whether they live or die. Jin Bing said coldly. Okay. Bullseye nodded. Turn around and leave. Jin will naturally not leave because of this matter, after all, his business has not been negotiated yet. At this time, I left because of anger, and the business was not discussed. His loss will only be greater. Only if the business is negotiated, his loss will not be too much. He stopped losses in time. In a blink of an eye, more than half an hour passed. Under the mutual stalemate between the two parties, the final deal was negotiated at the request of Jin Bin. The business was successfully negotiated, and Jin Bing, who was in a bad mood, also recovered a lot. All we have to do now is wait for Bullseye to bring people back. Bullseye is his strongest killer. But besides Bullseye, he's also made some recent recruits. There is also a Superman class whose body can be petrified. These guys are now under Bullseye command. Bullseye led the group of people. In Jin Bin's view, it would not be difficult to bring those three people back. As for what will not die after being hit by a bullet, it's nothing more than the Superman class with relatively strong resilience. After getting in touch with the hand, he already knew that there were some extraordinary humans in this world, and they possessed extraordinary powers. Just like those two green monsters two months ago, and Su Hong, that monster of monsters. After seeing off Clover, he did not leave the villa. Advertisement. This is just one of his properties, his real residence, which few people know. He stayed here, waiting for Bullseye to bring the man back. He felt that it would not be difficult to bring those people back with Bullseye's ability. Bang bang bang. Suddenly, there was a burst of gunfire outside. All kinds of screams followed. Jin Bin was stunned for a moment. What happened? Someone called him. Before he could think about it. Boom. The door of the room was suddenly kicked open from the outside. A guy in a red holster walked in from outside. The guy held two long silver knives in both hands. In his chest, there are two blood holes, which are bleeding out continuously. But the guy didn't seem to feel that he was hurt. Actions are quite normal and don't seem to be affected at all. The first one to come in was none other than Wade. Relying on his almost immortal resilience, this guy ignored the bullet net woven by the pile of bullets. Rushing to the front, most of Jin Bing's men in the villa died under his swords. Even the double knives made of secondary Edmund alloy are unparalleled in sharpness. Cutting metal is cutting iron like mud, let alone cutting people. No one can stop him at all. After Wade came in, Damon and Dave soon followed. Dave looked slightly embarrassed. Damon is much better, and he still has a dead dog in his hand. Damon threw the man on the ground casually. Jin Bin immediately recognized who the people on the ground were. It was the bullseye he sent out more than half an hour ago. Advertisement. Chapter 85, My name is Wade Wilson, Seeking Flowers, Five More. Advertisement. Seeing this scene, Jin Bin's expression, which was not very good at first, became more and more gloomy. At the same time, he also realized that the situation was not good for him. Definitely, to say that he was afraid, it wouldn't mean that he hadn't seen any big scenes before he became the underworld emperor in Hell's Kitchen. Everything he has today is not just obtained by brain. Although smart brains play a big part in it. Who are you? Why are you against me? Jin Bin said coldly. With that appearance, it seemed that the one who was at a disadvantage was not him, but Wade and the others. Hello, Kim Bin of this world, this is our first meeting, my name is Wade Wilson. My name is Wade Wilson, your name is Wilson Grant Faith, and speaking of which, we are both Wilsons, but I am behind and you are in front. But with your size, I think you're pretty good in the front, so I can be in the back. Nice position. Hashtag. What the hell was that guy talking about? Why didn't he understand? This guy must have just escaped from a mental hospital. Although Damon and Dave had already prepared. But I didn't expect Wade's words at this moment to be so shocking and informative. When they saw Wade wearing a red showy battle suit before, they had some doubts. Coupled with Wade's snarky voice, the suspicion increased even more. Now, this guy is saying something like that again. They really doubt that Wade is gay. Damon and Dave looked at each other, subconsciously took half a step back, away from Wade. Okay, the time for gossip is over, and the next step is to do business. Jin Bin, my boss asked me to greet you, and asked me to take a picture of you being stepped on by me. I hope you will not be ignorant and cooperate with me. Hearing Wade's words, Jin Bing narrowed his eyes slightly. In the next second, Jin Bing Bren suddenly moved. He chose to strike first. Because the distance between the two sides is not far, only five or six meters away. Advertisement. Such a distance, if the explosive power is enough, can be crossed in an instant. Although Jin Bin looks fat, but in fact he is a solid muscle. Very strong. 
His thigh muscles are also very exaggerated. This makes him extremely explosive. It can explode with terrifying speed and power in an instant. Damon reacted immediately. He directly pulled Dave to hide aside. He has been injected with super soldier serum, and his five senses are far superior to ordinary people. Even without the responsiveness of Spider-Man's spider telepathy. But not too bad. He reacted the first time Jinbin acted. The two just escaped. Jinbin's huge body rushed past where they were standing just now. Boom, there was a muffled sound. Jinbing's huge body hit the wall directly, because the strength is not small. The whole room trembled. As for Wade, he is also standing on the ground securely at this moment. It's just that the place to stand is on the other side of Damon and the others. At the same time, his right hand is holding a long silver knife horizontally. On the long knife, there are still some traces. Jin turned around, his face more and more hidden. Wiped the white ash off his face with his hands. His eyes fell on his right arm. I saw a hole in the white high end suit. A laceration appeared on his forearm. The wound was not small, and the everted muscles could already be seen. Advertisement. Blood was continuously flowing from the wound. I'm sorry, after suffering a few times, I have learned to be smart. After all, your hug is really not so easy to understand. To be honest, I can actually bear your hug, but the smell of your armpit is really hard for me to bear. After being reported by you last time, I, Vanessa, still asked if I went to eat shit. Damn it, she actually thinks I'm eating shit and won't kiss me anymore. Oh, sorry, I forgot that you are not from my world, and you don't know Vanessa. Vanessa was a beautiful woman, she was my girlfriend, but she died. Enough. Kim couldn't stand Deadpool's nonsense. This guy is buzzing like a fly in your ears, it's unbearable. It seems that you are a little angry, but you should be even angrier next time. In this way, we don't do anything, you just lie on the ground and let me take a photo to explain the task. After all, that's what my boss asked for. He's a good boss. He's restored me to my handsome self. I don't want to change back to that bad face, so how about you cooperate with me? I promise, I will not step on your face with too much force, I promise. Kim wasn't speaking, the moment Deadpool finished speaking. He charged at Deadpool again. But this time he was smarter. He knew that the knife in Deadpool's hand was dangerous. Ask for flowers. So he didn't just rush to Deadpool in a daze. Instead, he rushed to a place one meter in front of Deadpool and stopped. At this distance, if Deadpool slashes him with a knife, he can avoid it completely. In fact, he did dodge Deadpool's sudden knife. It's hard to imagine him with such a big body, but possesses such agility. After avoiding Deadpool's knife, he didn't do nothing. Before Deadpool was about to withdraw his hand, he grabbed Deadpool's knife hand with his hand. A powerful force erupted in an instant. Jinbing's muscles account for 90% of his body weight, and the exaggerated proportion of muscles also brings him great strength. Advertisement. With a full blow, he can hit more than 3 tons of impact. A punch can easily penetrate a solid concrete wall. And he was originally a fighting master, and close combat is his strong point. Zero. In terms of combat effectiveness, he is comparable to the Punisher. Even, if you don't use a weapon, Jin can easily defeat the Punisher in a single round of close combat. Because the power of the two is not at the same level. After grabbing Deadpool's arm, Jinbin had a chilling sneer on his face. The next second, his other hand pressed Deadpool's shoulder. Then the hand holding Deadpool violently exerted force. Tear, the sound of muscle tearing sounded. Deadpool's right hand was directly torn off by Kim. Blood sprayed out instantly. The smile on Jinbin's face became brighter and brighter. But his smile didn't last long. Because in the next second, a long knife was directly inserted into his abdomen. Severe pain was sent to his brain through the pain sensory nerve. He looked at Deadpool who was holding a long knife with his remaining hand in astonishment. Don't look at me like that. Although you ripped off one of my arms, it's not the first time someone has ripped off my arm like this. I'm used to it. This pain is nothing to me. It's you. 6. Jinbing's huge body fell directly to the ground. Even Jinbin was pierced by a sharp long knife in his abdomen, and the severe pain made the underworld emperor break out in cold sweat. He wasn't uninjured. But Deadpool's penetration hurt his kidney. This kind of pain cannot be tolerated just by saying it. Although he has great strength, his muscles are exaggerated. But he is just an ordinary person after all. Compared with the Jin Bin in the comics, the Jin Bin in the film and television dramas is quite a bit worse. Advertisement. Chapter 86, I'm sorry, I didn't control my strength well, seeking flowers, six more. Advertisement. After gold and fell, Deadpool picked up the right arm that Gang Jin Bing had torn off with a calm face. Then put it on the wound. The miraculous scene immediately began to happen. After the torn off right arm touched the wound, the granulation soared, and after a while, Wade's arm grew back again. He moved a little bit without any discomfort. As for the scene, Dave and Damon were a little taken aback. They knew Wade had insane resilience, bullets couldn't kill him. But I didn't expect that after this guy's arm was torn off, he could take it back so casually. The most important thing is that this guy has a calm face from the beginning to the end. Not even a scream. How many times has this guy been through this kind of thing, and how much he endured the pain, so that his arm can be ripped off, and he can use the other hand to penetrate the person without any problems. 793 then calmly pressed back the torn arm. Is that guy a robot? They would like to call Wade a werewolf, a little more ruthless than a werewolf. On the ground, and pale, 
The blood in the abdomen gushed out like money. Deadpool stepped forward and stomped directly on his face. Boom, his head hit the ground firmly. Obviously, Wade broke his promise. This guy stepped on the golden tie very hard, and he didn't step on it casually as he said just now. Oh, I'm sorry, it's a little out of control, but I guess you don't mind, right? And Wade said to himself. Jin Bing, who was stepped on by him, had a face as black as the bottom of a pot. Advertisement. His face was full of humiliation. It was the first time for him to be trampled on the face like this, even if he got up early to fight with others, when he was defeated, he had never been trampled on the face and humiliated. It can be said that Wade has already stepped on his face and dignity at the moment. He has never wanted to kill a person like this moment. Click. Deadpool took a picture with the phone he had brought. In the photo, he took off his mask, revealing a mouthful of white teeth, smiling obscenely. At his feet was a big gloomy and aggrieved face. Who else can it be if it's not gold? Okay, the task is done, in fact, it would be great if you cooperated with me so much earlier, in this way, no one will be injured, that's great. It turned out like this. Look at the injury on your stomach. If you don't go to the hospital for half a month, I'm afraid it won't heal. And I didn't do anything serious at the time. Your kidney may be injured by me. This will affect your health, your future sex life. But you have money, this one is bad. Just spend money to replace yourself with a better one. Wade pulled his foot away from Kim's face. He did not forget to sprinkle salt on Jin Bin's wounds with words. Dave and Damon looked at each other, and they both fully felt that it was a kind of torture to meet someone like Wade. Forget about physical torture, that mouth can also give you double torture verbal and mental. Anyway, if they were Jin Bin, they would have been pissed off by Wade. This guy's mouth is sometimes sharper than bullets. Okay, guys, my mission has been completed, I'm going to go back and report to the boss, do you want to stay here for a while? This is not Hell's Kitchen, the police should be dispatched very quickly. Deadpool's words just fell. Outside the villa, the siren of a police car came. Well, they've arrived. Dave panicked for a moment. Advertisement. A novice like him is most afraid of the police. But Deadpool and Damon are calmer. The two didn't take the police seriously at all. After all, they are habitual offenders. Let's go, since the task has been completed, then we can leave directly. Go through the back door. When I came here, I have already investigated how many ways to leave this villa. Come with me. It was Yin Meng who spoke. As a professional killer, a safe and evacuated route must be determined before the plan. This is his habit. And his mission is the same as Deadpool. Teach Kim a lesson, torture him, humiliate him. Now that Deadpool has completed the task by himself, there is no need for him to stay. After all, they came together. This task is also considered to be completed by them together. To be honest, except for that mouth of Deadpool, he actually likes this guy quite a bit, at least he kills fast enough, so he is qualified to eat the job of a killer. It's just that the hidden methods still need to be learned, it's too ostentatious. Deadpool pulled out the long knife stuck in Jin Bing's stomach. The latter rolled his eyes and almost fainted. After he got used to it a little bit, he immediately stared at Dead Man with the same eyes as if he were looking at Dead Man. He could see that these three guys didn't come to kill him, but to torture him. Otherwise, Deadpool's previous knife could have pierced his heart and killed him in one stroke. Watching the three of them leave, Jin Bing felt that he had lost a lot of blood, and his mind began to become a little chaotic. When the three of them left, the police outside also rushed into the villa. As soon as he came in, he saw Jin Bin lying on the ground with his face flushed. Damn it, it's Mr. Wilson Grand Faith. Someone attacked Mr. Wilson Grand Faith. North, call immediately and call an ambulance. Seeing Jin Bin who was injured on the ground, the leading policeman said directly, Advertisement. Although Jin is not the underworld emperor of Hell's Kitchen, his ostensible identity is actually a great philanthropist, and he is considered a relatively well-known person in New York. There are not many people who know him. Jin Bing also makes some news from time to time, and he is more famous for his classic fat smile, which looks very kind. It is not someone who knows his details, who would know that a fat man who smiles very kindly is Jin Bin, the famous underworld emperor in Hell's Kitchen. Mr. Faith, are you okay? Your face is so red, is it because you are angry? Shall I help you up? Jin Bing heard the words, and immediately said, No no need, Mr. Police, just wait for the medical staff to come, my abdomen is seriously injured. Is he upset? He was pissed off. That guy Deadpool is already on his must-kill list at this moment, and definitely, the boss that Deadpool talks about is also on his must-kill list. Although he still doesn't know who sent Death 2.0 to serve them. But sooner or later he would find out. If you don't kill him now, there will be times when he regrets it. At that time, he will also let them experience his mood at the moment. It's, alright. North, call the hospital and tell them to come over quickly. Mr. Faith is seriously injured, let them hurry up. If something happens to a big celebrity like Faith K, he must be unlucky to follow. After all, who made him appear here? He is responsible for the law and order in Manhattan. If something really happened to Jin, he couldn't escape the responsibility. If something happens to a great benevolent person like Jin Bin, a great philanthropist, and a rich man, he, the director of the Manhattan branch, will no longer have to be the director of the Manhattan branch. Unemployment awaits him. P.S. 6 more. Please vote for flowers, for the sake of my hard work. Advertisement. Chapter 87. Advertisement. 
On the other side, Su Hong has also returned to his villa. Claire and Mindy were back long ago. When Su Hong came back, the two were playing games with two controllers and a projector, and they were having a good time. There are all kinds of snacks next to them. Su Hong's villa has Michael as the housekeeper. If you need anything, you can ask him to contact someone to deliver it. When Su Hong came back, he didn't make any sound. But Claire has the power of the chicken charm, and discovers Su Hong immediately, but Mindy doesn't. She's only injected with the super soldier serum, after all. Welcome back, sir. Definitely, Michael was the first to know that Su Hong was back. You're back. Mindy stopped playing the game when he saw Su Hong came back. Stand up straight away. He ran up to Su Hong. She is not an ordinary girl, she is not used to doing too intimate actions with people. Mindy stopped playing, and Claire naturally couldn't play alone. Although she can control two controllers at the same time, it is not fun to do so, and it is completely unnecessary. Boss. Claire called out. You don't have to call me the boss at home, just call me Sue. 25. Claire, come with me, I have something to tell you. What Su Hong wants to talk about is naturally the universal capsule. After all, Su Hong will let Claire take over the entire Miracle Group instead of him. The next main business of Miracle Group is universal capsules. As for the controllable cold nuclear fusion technology, this is dominated by Stark Industries. Miracle Group did not design this aspect of the business. Nothing to do with Stark Industries either. So there is no need to say much about this matter. Just let Claire go to Stark Industries to check the accounts from time to time, and reconcile the accounts. Advertisement. After all, not only does he hold 40% of the shares of Stark Industries, he also has 60% of the commission by virtue of the controllable cold nuclear fusion technology. It is an alternative patent fee. These all need Claire to dock. And the current situation of Miracle Group. Although Su Hong controls the company through Michael in most cases. But some company executives, Claire still needs to know. Although Claire does not have a super brain, she is also very smart. Su Hong told her this without any effort. The next day, Su Hong took Claire to the company building, summoned all the executives, and announced that Claire became the CEO of Miracle Group. When Su Hong, the chairman, was away, Claire was the biggest one in Miracle Group. Has full authority to decide everything about the Miracle Group. It wasn't long before this was announced. It caused a great shock in the outside world. After all, Miracle Group is not a small company. It is a world-class super large group, and its monthly revenue is frighteningly high. I don't know how many people are jealous, but Su Hong is not such an active person. Su Hong's previous deterrence was still somewhat useful. Immediately afterwards, Miracle Group released another blockbuster. Miracle Group's next new product, Universal Capsules. This is an epic-making black technology product. After this thing, human life will be changed. Just when people thought it was a while before this thing came out. Miracle Group directly took out the finished product. Shown at the press conference, when seeing the employees of the Miracle Group directly release a villa with the Universal Capsule. Everyone was stunned. What does this mean? This means that when you go out on a trip in the future, you can directly bring your own home with you. This kind of technology is a proper super black technology. Advertisement. Since you can put a villa in it, then other things can also be put in. Airplanes, cars, all kinds of daily necessities. As for the army, you can directly put munitions, tanks, tanks, fighter jets, helicopters, etc. into it. It can be said that the birth of the universal capsule will not only change people's lives, but also change the form of war. Immediately after the press conference, Ross, on behalf of the military, submitted an order for a universal capsule to the Miracle Group. Definitely, more attention has been paid to Miracle Group's pricing on the Magnum capsules. Such a thing is really convenient for carrying things. As long as it is affordable, few people will refuse to buy a universal capsule. The Miracle Company also announced the price of the universal capsule soon. A universal capsule with a space of 1 cubic meter is priced at 180,000 US dollars each. A universal capsule with a space of 2 cubic meters is priced at 380,000 US dollars each. 5 cubic meters, priced at 880,000 US dollars. The above are basically used to install daily necessities, or some furniture. If you want to buy a universal capsule that can fit in an ordinary car, you need to spend 2.88 million US dollars. If you want to buy a universal capsule that can fit in a truck, you need to spend 9.88 million US dollars. If you want to buy a universal capsule that can hold a villa, you need 320 million US dollars. If you want to buy a universal capsule that can transfer to the next plane, you need to spend 1.25 billion US dollars. The higher you go, the more space you have, and the more money you need to spend. Like a universal capsule worth 180,000 US dollars, it is for the general public. Well-off families with a little money can also afford it. 2 cubic meters is for relatively wealthy families. It's considered a luxury item. 5 cubic meters, this kind is suitable for companies to buy, and then use it in work. The universal capsule that can hold a car, from here on, belongs exclusively to the rich. The minimum is 2.88 million US dollars, which is not something that ordinary families and well-off families can afford. Well-off families grit their teeth and spend 10 years saving, but they still have a chance to afford it. Advertisement. But that's not necessary at all. After all, universal capsules are not just needed. 
in the upward direction, only the rich can afford it. The press conference just ended. Tony Stark immediately called Su Hong. The first sentence is to order a universal capsule, the kind that can hold a private jet in a villa. Several of each. As for money, of course it is cash. He couldn't give Su Hong 50 billion in cash at once, because 893 was too much. But it's only a few billion, less than tens of billions of dollars, and it's still very easy for him to take out this money. And they already owe Su Hong 50 billion US dollars, and he is embarrassed to owe more. He Tony Stark is also a top rich man, and he is also a rich man. The cost of one of his Mark battle armors is several hundred million dollars, which shows that he is also very willing to spend money. Definitely, besides Tony Stark, there are quite a few rich people who called to order universal capsules. But these calls are not to Su Hong. Instead, hit Claire, the first CEO of Miracle Group. The reason why it is said to be the first term is because the previous Miracle Group has never had an executive president. Claire was first. There are many personal calls. And the official phone call quickly reached Miracle Group. Not one of the top 10 countries in the world has not called. After all, the advent of the universal capsule has not only changed people's lives, but also wars. If others have something you don't, then you just wait to be beaten. It can be said that Miracle Group has started a new round of equipment competition. Although this equipment is not a new type of weapon, the effect of the universal capsule is definitely not inferior to some powerful weapons. Because of its appearance, it is enough to change the world. P.S. This was originally an update for tomorrow, but after it was written, it was released in advance. Anyway, it has already been put on the shelves. The author really has no manuscripts at all. They are all coded now. It seems that there are so many updates case, more flowers. Advertisement. Chapter 88, New World, Shapeshifting King Kong, Seeking Flowers, Two More. Advertisement. In the blink of an eye, half a month has passed. After Claire took over Miracle Group, Su Hong was also completely free. If I have nothing to do on weekdays, I will go to the world of the Dark Knight Rises to find Selina to exchange feelings. Or go back to the world of the Walking Dead and recycle some gold. The amount of his account is also constantly increasing. Definitely, the growth rate is definitely not comparable to that in the Resident Evil world. And the Miracle Group in the Marvel world, after adding the Universal Capsule business. Revenues also soared. The half-month revenue report came out. From the previous half-month revenue of more than 100 billion US dollars, it directly soared to 5 trillion US dollars. The increase is exaggerated. The increase in medicines is not large, and the reason why the increase is so exaggerated is because of the Universal Capsules. Although the rich have also bought a lot, the proportion is actually not large. The real big ones are the orders placed by the governments of those countries. 5 trillion US dollars is all deposits paid by various countries. Accounting for 10% of the total amount, the follow-up money will be paid after Miracle Group ships the goods. Definitely, Chu Hong is not afraid of their repudiation. If they dare to renege on their debts, it is the same for him to get them himself. Definitely, the reason why the governments of various countries place a lot of orders is that Su Hong has not stipulated that they only accept US dollars, except for the need. The same goes for their own national currency. But how to set the price needs to be cost effective. But in general, it is good for them not to pay in US dollars. The happiest thing is Daxia. Of the 5 trillion US dollars in deposits, Daxia took 800 billion US dollars. Among all countries, it is currently the highest proportion. The subsequent amount is the real bulk. If it weren't for the big money in the world of Resident Evil, for Su Hong, this order is definitely a big one. But now, Su Hong no longer cares about this little money. Advertisement. After being idle for half a month, he also decided to go to the New World. Definitely, this time traveling to the New World, he intends to take someone with him. Not Claire, it's Wade. How should I put it, that guy Wade can also be called a time traveler in a certain sense, because he can break the dimension, see the bullet screen outside the world, and know things that others don't know. They have a little bit in common with Wade and Su Hong. As for his broken mouth, it seemed nothing to Su Hong. With Wade's little vocabulary, it's not enough to go to Daxia to line up with those internet trolls. It can only be said that Wade is still a little bit worse when it comes to spraying people. Swearing is out of date. In Daxia, the yin and yang talents are the real masters. Swearing is not dirty, that's called swearing. Boss, are you looking for me? During this time, Deadpool's life was very good. Su Hong has regained his former appearance, and he is no longer wearing the red tights. Usually wear normal clothes. Then go out and pick up girls. Because of the money, he has lived a very comfortable life recently. I also found a little girlfriend in this world. She is pretty long, and most importantly, she has a good figure. In Wade's words, he doesn't care about the face, what he values is the figure. He first fell in love with Vanessa because of her good figure. Anyway, life is now happy. I don't want to go to another world at all. As for where the money came from, it was naturally given by Su Hong, a generous boss. A few days ago, he once again discredited and went to Jin Bing's house, and sent Jin Bing who had just been discharged to the hospital again. Su Hong was happy and directly rewarded him with 10 million yuan. He also gave him a villa, and Curry picked a sports car he likes in his car. Advertisement. Wang Xim can be regarded as a rich man. Don't worry about money at all. Yes, I came here to ask you if you want to go to another world with me. 
Although I plan to take Deadpool with me, but Su Hong was never a forceful person, he would ask Deadpool's own opinion first. Go to other worlds, boss, can you go to other worlds? Deadpool was a little surprised. He didn't know that Su Hong could also travel through the world. Definitely yes, the people in this world who can travel across the world are not just you and me. To be honest, my life is pretty good now, but since you asked the boss, I definitely want it. It's the best to be by your side. Su Hong pushed Deadpool's head away with a look of disgust. This guy, playing tricks is quite interesting. It was just too greasy. What about your little girlfriend? It's okay, I'll leave the car to her, leave some money for her, and give her a small gift when I come back. This time, it shouldn't be too long, Neven. It won't be too long. I usually go out, maybe a month or two. Su Hong won't be away for too long either. Two months is the most. That's all right, when shall we go? Give you some preparation time, in two hours. The location is still here. Okay, then boss, I'm going to prepare. Two hours. Wait until Deadpool arranges his little girlfriend and comes back. Su Hong led him into the transmission channel. Time, May 2008. The location, the federal state, is still the New York that Su Hong is familiar with. Wow, is this the smell of the new world? It smells really good. Deadpool took a sharp breath. Advertisement. At the moment, he was no longer wearing his tight red battle suit. Because he thought it would hide his good looks. This is what he does not allow. For his new battle suit, he also gave up his own design. Because Su Hong said that if he performed well, he would make a better, more majestic, and more handsome battle suit for him. So, what effort did he make to design a battle suit? He is not engaged in clothing design. His specialty is killing. Battle suit design or something, let the professionals do it. Boss, what should we do next? How about finding a bar to have fun first? Shut up. Su Hong's voice sounded. Deadpool immediately shut up and didn't dare to speak. Su Hong was still very intimidating to him. Bai, Niu Hao Zhao, found that Su Hong is too rich. And he happened to be very poor, so he had to hold on to such a thigh, but he didn't dare to lose it. Otherwise, who will give him money in the future? After shutting Deadpool up, telepathy's ability activates. In the next second, a large number of thoughts were sensed by him. Definitely, the sea-like memory is also indispensable. Soon, Su Hong found some key words from the memory he read. Some familiar key figures were also found. Hoover Dam, District 13, Giant Rubik's Cube, Suspected Alien Objects. This is the world of the shape-shifting King Kong movie. And the timeline is still early, and the plot of the first part has not yet happened. From individual memories, Su Hong quickly understood which world they came to. Open the system mall. Searched for the shape-shifting King Kong Tinder source. Seeing the price of 8,000 trillion dollars, Su Hong immediately knew what he was going to do next. Advertisement. Chapter 89, The Rubik's Cube of the Fire Seed Source. Advertisement. Wait, there's something to do. Ah, uh, boss, have you decided which bar to go to? I'm not familiar with this world. Do you have any good recommendations? You can go to the bar later, I will take you to another place now. Where? Hoover Dam. It was built in April 1931 and completed in March 1936. Black Gorge is located on the border of Nevada and Arizona. The dam is 221.4 m high, 200 m wide at the bottom, 14 m wide at the top, and 377 m long. The reservoir formed by the dam is called Lake Mead, with a total storage capacity of 34.85 billion cubic meters. The Colorado River under the dam was originally the deepest and most turbulent river in the Commonwealth, but after the dam was built, the originally turbulent river became gentler. But few people know that in the 1960s, the federal government built a secret base under the dam. It is called the 13th District. There are very few people who know this place in the entire Federation. Except for the President and related officials, almost no one knows that there is a secret base under the Hoover Dam. Because a vital secret of the Federation is stored here. An item from an alien civilization. A huge amounts of metal cube Rubik's Cube, the length, width, and height of the cube magic are 33.3 meters. It weighs more than 300 tons. In order to get this thing to the 13th district under the dam, it can be said that the federal government took a lot of effort to succeed. This thing has been here for decades. Relying on this Rubik's Cube, many scientists have been inspired by it and invented many novel things. It can be said that this Rubik's Cube has greatly contributed to the advancement of human civilization. P.S. The settings in the movie, the cars, airplanes, and many electrical appliances in the human world are all inspired by shape-shifting King Kong, and then invented by humans. Its importance is of course needless to say. Advertisement. However, the 13th district did not do too much protection. One is that there is a U.S. military base less than 50 kilometers away from the Hoover Dam. If something happens here, the fighter planes over there can fly over at any time. For fighters, the distance of 50 kilometers is nothing at all. At full speed, it takes less than 3 minutes to arrive. 2. The Tinder Rubik's Cube is too big, not to mention its exaggerated size, its terrifying weight of more than 300 tons, even if someone really had an idea of it and scored it here. He also couldn't take away the Rubik's Cube in a short time. And the fighter planes will come over as soon as possible. 3. This is a secret base after all, and the fewer people who know about it, the better, so that there is no possibility of the secret base being exposed this time. In the case of the first two reasons, the 13th district does not need too much protection. 
in the 13th district. The soldiers in charge of security held guns and chatted while patrolling. They have been working here for several years, and there has never been any invasion here. Every day is patrolling day after day, without any accidents. After a long time, their patrol work became more casual. Even if the officer sees it, it's nothing. Because since the establishment of the 13th district, there has never been any invasion incident. This is the mainland of the federal state, and the secrecy work is done well. No one in the outside world knows that there is such a place as the 13th district in the federal state. Two soldiers were walking and talking. In the next second, there was a flash of light in front of the two of them. The two were dazzled by the light, and raised their heads subconsciously. I saw a round door with golden light suddenly appearing in the void ahead. Two people walked out of the round door emitting golden light. Advertisement. One Asian, one European. The two soldiers froze for a moment. But before they could understand what was going on, they sounded the alarm. The two of them felt their spirits suddenly loosened, and they were indescribably sleepy. Two plops. The two fell directly to the ground, losing consciousness. Deadpool froze for a moment, he was about to make a move, but he didn't expect to wait for him to do so. Those two guys just passed out. He knew that Su Hong must have made the move. Let's go. Oh. Deadpool nodded blankly. He glanced at the two guys who fainted on the ground, and then followed Su Hong. Along the way, Deadpool constantly saw faint, CFFE, people on the ground. Needless to say, it must be because of Su Hong. The powerful telepathy ability made Su Hong enter the 13th district as if he had entered no one's land. Soon, he brought Deadpool to the Tinder Cube. Even Deadpool was shocked when he saw the huge amounts of Spark Cube. Huge things can be shocking. And the Fire Seed Source Rubik's Cube in front of him is not only big, but also moving. It looks like a living thing, not a dead thing. Boss, this is your goal. Looking at the huge amounts of the Fire Seed Source Rubik's Cube in front of him, Deadpool is not stupid. Immediately understood the purpose of Su Hong's coming here. Su Hong came here for the Fire Seed Source Rubik's Cube. In the system, the selling price of an infinite gems is 1,200 trillion US dollars. Advertisement. The price of the Rubik's Cube is as high as 8,000 trillion US dollars. It was written as 800 trillion US dollars, and I thought it was unreasonable, so I changed it to 8,000 trillion US dollars. After all, Tinder is the god who can create the shapeshifting King Kong family. With this thing, you are equivalent to the shapeshifting King Kong creator. You can have as many shapeshifting King Kong as you want, definitely. The premise is that the metal tube is enough. The difference between the two is almost seven times. Definitely, what Su Hong valued about the fire source was not its price. After all, even if Su Hong recycles this thing, the system will recycle it at a discount. For example, 80 trillion US dollars are recycled by the system at a 20% discount. Only 16 trillion US dollars will be given. Su Hong was stupid to recycle this kindling source to the system. Su Hong's real purpose is actually to control the source of fire, and to be the creator of the shapeshifting King Kong himself. The shapeshifting King Kong race is a powerful mechanical life race. Their combat power can't be said to be top-notch. In the Marvel world, if it's a big battle like the Avengers Alliance 4, the ordinary shapeshifting King Kong is basically cannon fodder. But what makes them great is their numbers, their terrifying lifespan, and work efficiency. Su Hong intends to create a batch of shapeshifting King Kong to dig gold for himself. The universe is huge, and although the Earth is special, it is not the only planet where gold exists. Although scientists say that in the solar system, the Earth's gold content is the highest. Even if other planets have gold, it won't be too much. But scientists are not necessarily right. After all, the universe that humans understand is too small. And the real universe is too huge. It is absolutely impossible for the planet with gold to be the Earth. Create shapeshifting King Kong to mine gold for yourself, this path is completely feasible. Moreover, to create a shapeshifting king, some common tasks can also be handed over to the shapeshifting king. Ordinary shapeshifting King Kong is not enough to look in front of those perverted superheroes. But for ordinary humans, they are garbage cleaners. It is still very efficient to clean up miscellaneous fish. Advertisement. Chapter 90, Mutations in the Source of Fire, Seeking Flowers, 4 more. Advertisement. Definitely, how to take away the Rubik's Cube and how to use it is also a problem. If other people face this situation, there must be no way. Even for shapeshifting King Kong, they only know how to initially use the fire source, use it to replenish energy, and create new shapeshifting King Kong. But they can't set to create the perfect shapeshifting King Kong they want. For example, Megatron, he got the fire source, and he can only use the fire source to create a large-scale shapeshifting King Kong army. But basically some low-level shapeshifting King Kong. He has no brains and can only be used as a haze of cannon fodder. A high-level shapeshifting King Kong needs time to grow, not to mention the leadership level. Even if there is a fire source, it cannot be created. This is the creator's unique ability. Not even if you have the fire source in hand. This is like using guns. The owner of the gun can shoot 10 rings with his gun, but you can only pull the trigger to shoot the bullets out. It is a truth. The source of fire in the hands of the creator is different from that in the hands of Megatron and the others. Although Su Hong is not the creator, but he has a system. As long as you have money, there is nothing you can't buy from the system. Su Hong can't turn himself into a creator, but he can make himself have the same ability as a creator. 
For example, completely control the Rubik's Cube of the Fire Seed Source. System, how much does it cost to purchase a method to completely control the Rubik's Cube of the Fire Seed Source? A dollar two billion. The system gives a price. It's not low, but for Su Hong now, it's definitely not expensive, and it can even be said to be very cheap. After all, his current account balance is as high as more than 400 trillion US dollars. 2 billion US dollars is an astronomical figure for ordinary people, but for him, it is really nothing. Direct purchase. You only need 2 billion US dollars when you see it. Su Hong chose to buy without any hesitation. After successful purchase, a large amount of information also appeared in Su Hong's brain. Advertisement. There is a lot of information, even scary. If ordinary people suddenly bear so much information, even if they don't become idiots, they will feel uncomfortable for a long time. But Su Hong has a super brain and an extremely high spirit, so he is not affected at all. It is easy to organize all the information. Looking up, the fire seed source Rubik's Cube has lost its mysterious brilliance in his eyes, and there are no more secrets at all. No need to step forward. The ability to control magnetism activates. The fire seed source Rubik's Cube in front of him began to spin rapidly. Then the huge amounts of volume started to shrink. A moment's work. With huge amounts of fire seed source Rubik's Cube, it becomes a sharp object with both ends of the fruit knife world. Then it flew towards Su Hong and fell into Su Hong's hands. Deadpool looked at this scene and was stunned. This was the first time he knew that his new boss, Su Hong, was so powerful. Just let those people faint outside. After coming in now, without any movement, the big thing became smaller by itself and flew into Su Hong's hands. With this strength, if he faced Su Hong, he would definitely be abused. The method Su Hong showed just now reminded him of two people, Professor X and Magneto. He is no stranger to these two. He once also tried to join the X-Men at Xavier's school. It's a pity that people look down on him. Professor X and Magneto, as long as they are mutants, few people are unfamiliar with them. After all, these two are at the top of the mutant pyramids. They are all top-notch mutants. In mutant, it's hard to find a few more powerful than them. The tinder source was in his hand. Su Hong could clearly feel the energy contained in the little fire source in his hand. That is terrifying energy countless times larger than the sun. Advertisement. The moment Su Hong came into contact with the fire source, the cells in his body subconsciously absorbed the energy inside. In the next second, a terrifying energy vortex erupted, and Deadpool on the side didn't react at all. The whole person was directly rushed out by the terrifying energy vortex. Su Hong was taken aback by the sudden change. But he came back to his senses in an instant, walked into a space door holding the fire source, and then, his figure appeared in the vacuum of the universe outside the Earth. The terrifying energy erupted again. This time, it was thousands, tens of thousands of times more violent than the previous eruption. In an instant, Su Hong seemed to have transformed into an aurora. Earth, people in the northern hemisphere at this moment raised their heads. Because they saw the aurora in the sky like a touch of golden dye splashed by God. Dazzling and beautiful. No one knows why this scene appears in the sky. But this does not prevent people from admiring its beauty at the moment. Some people simply took out their mobile phones to take pictures. Then publish it online. Countless people were amazed by this scene, and some couples even made a wish to the aurora in the sky. 13 districts. Deadpool got up from the ground. The impact just now shattered all the bones in his body, but his bones are just recovering. Ask for flowers. For him, such pain can't even make him frown. Just a little dizzy. After all, he flew a constant distance in the air. When he stood up and looked around, he froze, because Su Hong is gone. But the place where Su Hong stood just now left a big hole. What's the situation? It's over, the boss is gone, my golden job. Wade looked like he had lost his parents. Don't howl, I'm fine. Advertisement. Su Hong's voice suddenly rang in Deadpool's mind. The latter was stunned for a moment, and then realized that something happened to Su Hong's. Boss, are you okay? You scared me to death. What about you? Why didn't I see you? And why did your voice appear directly in my brain? You probably have it. Zero. That's right, you guessed it right. I have both Professor X and Magneto abilities, and they are both stronger than them. Wade gasped. He now knows how powerful Su Hong is. A single Professor X or Magneto, and that's monsters. If the abilities of two monsters appear on one person, wouldn't that person have to become a monster among monsters? He understood why those people fainted for no reason at first. Then where are you now, boss? You leave that secret base, go outside and look up at the sky, and you will know where I am. Deadpool looked puzzled. Look up at the sky and know where he is? Deadpool wasted no time either. Run directly towards the exit of the 13th district. As for asking why he knows where the exit is, as a professional mercenary, knowing where to leave is a basic skill. After leaving the 13th district, he came to the outside of the dam. Then he looked up to the sky. In the sky, the dazzling aurora almost occupied half of the sky. Boss, you said you can see you when you look up. The one in the sky, could it be you? Deadpool said in disbelief. He believed that Su Hong could hear him speaking here. What do you think? I had a little accident, you guess I will. Is this a small accident? Deadpool has already determined that the aurora in the sky was created by Su Hong. Maybe Su Hong is in the center of the aurora right now. It's hard to imagine how Su Hong made such a big commotion. 
Although Professor X and Magneto are also very powerful, they are completely inferior to Su Hung Ryu in terms of movement and movement. Advertisement. Chapter 91. Advertisement. In the cosmic vacuum, Su Hong was at the center of the energy burst. The energy of the fire source is huge. In Su Hong's view, even the energy of a hundred suns is not comparable to the energy contained in the fire source, and it is far inferior. The price of this thing in the system is only 8,000 trillion US dollars, and Su Hong feels that the price is too low. At least 8 trillion US dollars is reasonable. At this moment, Su Hong's body cells are frantically absorbing the energy of the fire source. Before contacting the fire source, Su Hong did not expect this scene to happen. Definitely, this accident is good for him. The more energy he absorbs, the stronger he will be, and he can feel that he is evolving into a new energy. Although he is not a silver super now, he can evolve any ability he wants. However, in the case of corresponding energy absorption, it is also possible to evolve a special ability. Like now, originally, Su Hong had no interest in infinite gems. But judging from the current situation, an infinite gems may be a brand new and powerful ability for him. Since Thanos will also grab it, why can't he be the one who grabs infinite gems? And in the system, the price of an infinite gems is 1,200 trillion US dollars. It seems that there are not many fire sources. But at such a price, even a super rich Marvel like Tony may not be able to earn so much money in his entire life. Because there are too many. This is not money that can be earned by ordinary means at all. Su Hong made a lot of money in the Resident Evil world before, and he only made hundreds of trillions of dollars. Trillions are not up. Advertisement. This is still the case when his profits are extremely high. If the profit is not as high as Su Hong's, I want to earn trillions of dollars. Even for a person like Tony, it is difficult to earn such a huge amount of money in a lifetime. In other words, Su Hong can enter other worlds and collect wealth from other worlds to have such a huge wealth. But even for him, so far, the balance of the system has not broken through the quadrillion level. It can be seen how difficult it is to earn a trillion level amount. As energy is absorbed, Su Hong could feel his stats in all aspects increasing all the time. Speed, strength, endurance, spirit, and even soul are all constantly growing. And because of the tiger talisman, Su Hong's body has always been in an extremely balanced situation, and there will never be too much energy in his body, too much energy, and riots or the like. So, I don't know how much time has passed. The body that Su Hong found reached a zero point. In the next second, Su Hong felt something in his heart, knowing that he had another ability. And his body is not autonomously absorbing the ability of the fire source. Definitely, to interrupt the body's absorption of the fire source energy, Su Hong could do it from the very beginning. But he didn't stop it, because he knew that absorbing the energy of the fire source would be good for him. After interrupting the absorption of the fire source energy, the aurora also dissipated. The universe is back to how it was before. This aurora lasted for a full 8 hours. This also means that Su Hong has absorbed the energy of the fire source for 8 hours. Su Hong didn't care about how much energy he had absorbed. Instead, it directly calls up its own property panel. Advertisement. Fill money will strengthen the system. Host, Su Hong. Age, 2-2. Race, superhuman race. Xiao Yuan, immortality. Money, 489 trillion US dollars. P.S. This book sets an ounce of gold at 1,820 US dollars, and the amount after 100 million will not be recorded. Items, Gothic Dark Elixir, Contact Lens, Universal Capsule. Ability, Plane Teleportation, Cooling Time is 3 hours, can be upgraded with money, Reducing Cooling Time, Super Self-Healing Regeneration, Cold Weapon Proficiency, Hot Weapon Proficiency, Spider Telepathy, High Speed Movement, X-Men Quicksilver Version, Green Titanization, Perfect Version, Telepathy, Magnetic Control, Power of 12 Spells, Energy Absorption, Super Strength, Super Speed, Super Hearing, Heat Ray, Frozen Breath, Perspective, Super Vision, Super Brain, Super Thinking. Biology force field, steel body, microscopic vision, idealism, mechanical creator. 1. The ability column, compared to the beginning, is not a little bit more. Except for a bunch of abilities that rely on the Superman serum. After Su Hong absorbed the energy of the fire source, he also gained a new ability. Mechanic creator. With this ability, Su Hong can create a shape-shifting King Kong even if he doesn't have a fire source. As long as he has energy in his body, he can keep creating new shape-shifting King Kong. And these shape-shifting King Kong can also create them according to his ideas. For example, the original intention of their creation will determine their subsequent form and ability. And according to the different levels of wisdom bestowed upon them by Xu Hong himself, the created shape-shifting King Kong can be divided into low level, the lowest intelligence, equivalent to a 7 or 8 year old human child, medium level, equivalent to a 13 or 14 year old human boy, high level level, equivalent to a human being over 20 years old, relatively calm, top, equivalent to a human being in his 40s or 50s, who has experienced vicissitudes in the world has rich experience, has wisdom in his heart, and is equivalent to a leader-level shape-shifting King Kong. This is Su Hong's new ability, an ability that is more convenient than using the fire source to create shape-shifting King Kong. This means that as long as the energy is sufficient, he can create a mechanical army at any time and set off a mechanical frenzy. 
As for the energy in his body, he himself doesn't know how much energy is in his body. It may not be endless, but it is certain that it will not be exhausted. Even if it can be used up, if you shine it in the sun, most of it will be restored immediately. Don't worry about energy or anything at all. Even if there is no energy, the source of fire is in his hands. Advertisement. This is equivalent to an energy source that can provide him with energy anytime, anywhere, and on any occasion. There is no need to worry about not having enough energy. On the earth. Wade was squatting on the ground board, playing with stones. Su Hong asked him to wait for him for a while, but the wait lasted for several hours. He was very bored, but he didn't know what to do. He doesn't have Su Hong's might and magic ability. From here to the city, there is still a long distance, so he simply plays here with Shizier 1.7 and waits for Su Hong's return. I'm bored. The afterglow of the golden light beside him flashed like him. Wade looks sideways. Su Hong walked out from the magic door. Wade immediately jumped up excitedly. Thank God, boss, you are finally back, I'm almost bored to death. Who knows how he, a broken-mouthed person, stayed alone for more than eight hours. Anyway, with such an experience, he didn't want to come here for the second time. If it's in a lively bar, he can play for three days and three nights. But here alone in a daze, he couldn't stay for an hour. No hurry, next, I'll take you to a fun place. With a wave of his hand, Su Hong opened a magic door again. Then go to the magic door. Wade followed immediately. He really didn't want to stay in this boring place any longer. Advertisement. Chapter 92, Michaela Baines, Seeking Flowers, One More. Advertisement. Crow Bar. Located on the westernmost lot of Crow Drive. It's not a big bar, but it's not small either. Although it is not in the downtown area, the business is not bad at all. The reason is simple. Because there is a high school nearby, Changzhong High School. A favorite weekday hangout for high schoolers at school is the Crow's Bar. There are clear regulations in the federal state that drinking alcohol is not allowed in public places, and no drinking is allowed under the age of 21. The high school students are all 17 or 18 year old boys and girls, so naturally they don't meet the standard for drinking alcohol at the age of 21. But they can drink juice, anyway they sell juice in my bar, no matter what you ask, I sell juice. As for why the juice smells a bit like wine, it is because it has been fermented for too long and it is a little sour. But the students like to drink this, this is their own hobbies, I can't stop their hobbies. Because there are many schoolgirls here. Naturally, more men came here. Business will naturally improve 25. In the center of the bar, there is a stage. On the stage, several student girls in cool clothes were twisting their bodies along with the blaring music in the bar, attracting the attention of the older men below. They are all high school students in nearby schools. As for why they dance here. Naturally, it's a part-time job. As long as you have good looks, even if your dance is not very good, as long as you wear cool clothes, you can get a reward of 500 US dollars for 4 hours when you go on stage. After all, those men came here to see what they were for, and they understood. $500 for 4 hours is equivalent to an hourly wage of $125. This price is already very high. For high school students like them, it is not a small sum. One jump is enough for them to spend a lot of time. Definitely, the performance after coming on stage is not so easy. Advertisement. It's okay to meet some better customers, at most they just look around and don't make any moves. When I meet some bad customers, I like to mess around when I get drunk. Once the sperm is in the brain, it is easy to do some irrational things. It is not uncommon for the schoolgirls dancing here to be taken advantage of. 8 o'clock in the evening is also the most crowded and lively time in Crow's Bar. In the bar, not to mention the rubbing of shoulders, but it is basically people bumping into each other, and you need to squeeze and squeeze every step of the way. It can be said that the business is very good. Wade expressed his liking for the warm atmosphere of Crow's Bar. As soon as this guy entered the bar, his body twisted along with the exciting music in the bar. It's not okay to be coquettish. Definitely, his eyes were not idle either. He kept scanning back and forth in the crowd, looking for his favorite target. Soon, Wade hit a target. Boss, I have my eye on a target. I'm going to play first. Call me if you need something. Wade said, and ran away directly after speaking. After knowing Su Hong's ability, Jida is not worried that Su Hong can't find him. Su Hong can communicate with him in the vacuum of the universe. Even if he went to the other end of the earth now, Su Hong could still contact him at any time. So he was no longer worried about getting lost with Su Hong. Su Hong nodded. Then, Wade was seen walking towards a young woman who looked 30 years old. In terms of face, Su Hong only scored around 70 points. He looks Latino, with thick black lips. In terms of body shape, it is very good. Anyway, Su Hong is not interested. It can only be said that that guy Wade has such unique hobbies. Advertisement. When he first watched the Deadpool movie, he thought Vanessa was average. Looking at it now, that guy Deadpool's vision is indeed mediocre. Su Hong, on the other hand, walked in another direction. Su Hong's height of 1.9 meters is still very eye-catching in the crowd. He is also handsome, wearing a white suit and a white top hat. It gives people a sense of sight of an oriental prince. Under his strength, he easily pushed through the crowd and came to his target person. Although making money is the top priority, in the process of making money, enjoying life, and finding happiness is also Su Hong's attitude towards life. 
Therefore, even after obtaining the new ability, he did not choose to try the new ability immediately. Instead, he brought Wade to this bar. Su Hong also had his own reasons for coming to Crow's Bar. They were in Nevada before, and now they are in Los Angeles, California. Although the two states are adjacent. But the distance here is not short, and it takes at least a few hours to drive. Go to the bar counter. Su Hong patted the shoulders of several middle-aged men. The man was staring at the beautiful woman beside him when he was suddenly patted on the shoulder. He froze for a moment, turned around and saw Su Hong. He frowned and was about to say something. Su Hong directly took out a stack of US dollars from his pocket. This seat belongs to me, and these belong to you. The original dissatisfaction on the middle-aged man's face disappeared immediately, and turned into a smile. It was as if he had seen his own father. He stood up quickly and gave up his seat. Su Hong directly threw the wad of dollars to him. Advertisement. The latter grabbed them cautiously, put them in his pocket without counting the exact number, and left. Although beautiful women are good-looking, they are not their own. Once you get the money, it's yours. And Su Hong gave quite a lot, several thousand dollars must have been there. With so much money, it is enough for him to find a beautiful model and be comfortable for a few days. 150. He'd be stupid for not doing it. The man left, and Su Hong sat down. As soon as Su Hong sat down, the woman beside him looked sideways at him. In fact, Su Hong knew that since he appeared here, women began to peek at him. It's just that the movement was so small that she thought Su Hong didn't know. The woman looked like she was in her early twenties, with wheat skin. Apparently, he's also Latino. He is well proportioned and has long black hair. There is a silver earring on the ear and a silver chain around the neck, which looks very trendy. Definitely, it also set off a bit of wild beauty to her. This woman, Su Hong, was no stranger. Because she is the heroine in the first part of shapeshifting King Kong, Michaela Baines. But now she is not with Sam yet. Instead, she randomly found a bully in school to be her boyfriend, which was her shield. After all, she is beautiful and has a good figure. In school, she has many suitors. Tired of dealing with it, she randomly found a school bully to be her boyfriend and used his identity as a shield to deal with those annoying pursuits. As for how Su Hong knew so clearly, learn more about telepathy ability. In front of Su Hong, as long as he wants, no one has any secrets in front of him. Advertisement. Chapter 93, No One Can Ever Trouble Me, Seeking Flowers, Two More. Advertisement. Actually, you didn't have to give him that much money just now. If you give me the money, I can change to a seat next to it. It was Michaela Baines who spoke. You know I'm here for you. Su Hong asked with a smile. I'm still very confident in my appearance. Michaela Baines looked at Su Hong and said. An inexplicable emotion brewed in her eyes. Not to mention Su Hong's heroic move just now, and not to mention the cheap clothes on his body. With Su Hong's looks and height, he is more than enough to go to Hollywood. Such a man, even she, cannot ignore it. Humans are, above all, visual creatures. She is still in a relatively young period, and she looks more at her appearance than her wealth. Definitely, judging from Su Hong's appearance, he doesn't look like a poor man. Then congratulations, you guessed right, I am indeed here for you, after all, although there are many beauties here, I think you are the most beautiful among them. Thank you, no one doesn't like to hear others praise themselves. Especially the one who praised himself was a handsome guy, what country are you from? Although there are Asians in our class, none of them are as tall or handsome as you. Big Xia people. Your class? Looks like you're still studying. Yes, I'm a high school student. I'm 18 years old this year. 18 years old, I'm no older than you. I'll treat you to whatever you want to drink. Su Hong waved his hand. If you want to pick on me, I have a boyfriend. Really? But I didn't see it, and if you care about your boyfriend, he should be by your side now instead of me sitting beside you right now. He just hasn't come yet, he will come later, and there are a lot of them, you will be in trouble. Advertisement. Su Hong smiled. I've never had anyone to give me trouble. Say CAO 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 DEO. Michaela had just finished talking about her boyfriend before arriving. Her boyfriend is here. Her boyfriend didn't come alone. Also brought five friends. Six of them are over 1.8 meters tall. Two of them are almost 1.9 meters. Looks long and strong. Because they are all from the school football team. If you don't have a good height and a strong body, you can't play rugby at all. If someone hits you and you fall down, then why are you playing football? Therefore, those who can enter the school football team have no poor physical fitness. Otherwise, his boyfriend couldn't be a bully. Su Hong was tall, and although he didn't look thin, he couldn't tell if he had any muscles in his clothes. He is alone again. And there are six people on his boyfriend's side. Once there is a conflict, Su Hong must suffer. After all, young people don't care about anything when their heads are up. John is the captain of the school football team. Also Michaela's school bully boyfriend. He's not captain because he's the best football player of them all. It's because he has the best family conditions among them. As soon as he was in high school, his rich dad bought him an off-road vehicle worth more than 400,000 US dollars. Advertisement. For that car, he is more precious than his old wolf. It has never been borrowed, and it is washed frequently, so it cannot be allowed to get dirty. You know, he is still just a high school student. And now the monthly wages of ordinary people in the federal state are only around 1,000 to 2,000 dollars. Only the wages of those white-collar workers are higher. 
But even so, the monthly salary of a high-level white-collar worker is only about 6,000 to 9,000 US dollars. 400,000 is a huge expenditure for most well-off families, and it may not even be affordable. And it was just an 18th birthday present from his dad. It can be seen that his family conditions are. It is precisely because of the good conditions in his family that he can become the captain of the rugby team. Because he is rich. As soon as he entered the bar, John looked towards Kemera's favorite seat on weekdays. In the past, when he came, Camila would basically be surrounded by men. Because Kemera is beautiful. He has never seen anything that can resist her charm. But he doesn't care. Because those sitting around Kemera are basically middle-aged people over 30 years old. These people are older than him, and he doesn't have money, so he doesn't worry about being knocked into a corner at all. But this time, as soon as he came, he saw a handsome young Asian guy sitting beside Camila. And not just handsome. He's the kind of handsome guy who can go to Hollywood and be sure to make it out. There is no shortage of handsome guys in Hollywood, but there is a shortage of handsome guys in the wings. And Su Hong is obviously that kind of handsome guy, especially when the other party is talking and laughing with his girlfriend. He immediately felt angry. Advertisement. Pushing away the person in front of him ruthlessly, he rushed towards Su Hong and Kemera. Those who are pushed away are naturally dissatisfied. But as soon as they saw John's tall and strong figure and saw that they were ten people, even if you are dissatisfied, you can only endure it. Young people fight regardless of severity, and he doesn't want to go to the hospital. Boy, who are you? I don't know if she already has a boyfriend. John walked up to Su Hong and said coldly to Su Hong. While speaking, he stared at Su Hong coldly, as if he was about to pounce on him in the next second. The friend behind him also looked at Su Hong fiercely. They were with John, and now that someone is picking on John's girlfriend, they naturally want to help. Maybe when John is happy, he asks his father to support their parents, and maybe their family can also get rich or something. Not to mention making a fortune, at least wealth freedom. I know, is that person you? Su Hong didn't panic at all, but asked back with a smile. What do you think? I don't want to do anything today, if you are sensible, get out now, otherwise, I will let you taste the pain of bloodshed later. John, Zhao Qinhao, don't do this. As soon as John finished speaking, Camilla frowned, and said. She doesn't like boys fighting because of her, and she doesn't want anyone to get hurt because of her. Because it represents trouble. The most important thing is that she has no feelings for John, and John is just her shield. Although the two have been together for more than 10 days, so far they have only held hands at most. She didn't do the other party any favors at all. And John wasn't angry either. Because Kemera is beautiful enough, such a girlfriend is also enough to have face. After all, having a beautiful girlfriend and making other people envious is a very showy thing. What young people like them like most is to be in the limelight. But no matter what, Kemera is also his girlfriend in name. If Kemera falls in love with someone else, what will he do? That's why he was so angry when he saw Su Hong talking and laughing with Kemera. Advertisement. Chapter 94, Do You Have a Car? Seeking Flowers, Three More. Advertisement. Kemera, what is your relationship with him? It's okay, I don't even know his name, John, can you please stop? What's wrong with me? You don't even know his name, and you still chat with her so happily. What do you think of me? John, what you are saying now is very childish, do you know that? Do you have to worry about me chatting with others? I definitely don't care if you chat with others, but this guy doesn't look like a good person at first glance, he must have bad intentions for you. I'm just asking him to leave here now, don't worry about this matter, just leave it to me. After speaking, John looked at Su Hong again. Did I warn you just now and told you to leave directly, and you are still sitting here, do you not take my words seriously? Hey, guys, what are you arguing about? I just heard someone say they want to fight. A voice suddenly sounded from the side. John and the others looked puzzled. Is anyone stupid enough not to see that their side is arguing? At this time, if you don't hide away a little bit, and take the initiative to come over, is it courting death? Go away. John said nothing. But a man behind him who was nearly 1.9 meters tall yelled at Wade. After speaking, he stretched out his hand to push Wade. Didn't take Wade seriously at all. 293 Wade is not tall, only about 1.78 meters. It doesn't look strong, and it's a little skinny. So the guy didn't take Wade seriously at all. Wade grinned. Watching the other person reach out and push his hand. Backhand grab. One mistake? Ah damn it, let go, it hurts me to death. The man screamed. It turned out that Wade directly buckled his hand down, and the man who was nearly 1.9 meters kneeled directly on the ground in pain. He tried to pull back his hand, but Wade's hands were like iron clamps, making it impossible for him to pull back his hand. Just kidding, Wade is not a powerful superhero though, but he's not weak either. It's just that compared to those powerful superheroes, Wade's strength is not worth mentioning at all. But in fact, Wade's strength is not small, it can even be said to be four or five times stronger than ordinary people. Advertisement. His pair of secondary Edmund alloy swords are not light. And the two double knives he can dance are as fast as a whirlwind, parrying bullets. It can be seen that his strength is actually not small. If he was weak, it would be impossible to swing the knife so fast, even fast enough to block bullets. The impact of the bullet is also very exaggerated. But Wade can cut bullets with a knife. His strength, 
CFFD, has never been small, but compared to those powerful superheroes, it seems a bit small. In fact, his history is not small. Why are you still standing there? Help me. The sudden scene stunned everyone. Even John was stunned. Although they speak harshly. But after all, they are just high school students. This is the first time they have encountered this situation. After several seconds, John's voice sounded. Everyone came back to their senses. Then hurried forward to help. But a group of high school students are no match for Wade. Don't think Wade is as tall as them. But the strength is greater than them, and the speed is faster than them. Not to mention that he also served in the special forces, and later became a mercenary. The number of people who died at his hands is unknown. The six are just tall and strong high school students who don't know how to fight at all. Picking them up is like playing with them. After a while, John and the others all got down on the ground. Howling on the ground. Because there was too much movement, it finally attracted the attention of other people in the bar. But eating melons is something that people from all over the world like to do. There are not only people who eat melons in Daxia, but there are also many people in the Federation. For trouble, no one likes. No one likes to take trouble on themselves. Advertisement. So after seeing someone fight, people around were surprised though, but all retreated further, to avoid trouble. And the person in charge of the bar soon heard about the incident. Security came quickly. Sir, we don't allow fighting here, now, can you please go out with us? Because Wade was standing alone, and many people saw that it was Wade who made the shot. As soon as the security came over, he yelled at Wade. Wade saw a couple of security guards and didn't even bother with them. Instead, he kicked John on the ground again. The latter let out a scream. As for Camilla, she never pleaded for John's mercy from the beginning to the end. She has seen that Wade and Su Hong are in the same group. But that doesn't mean she's pleading for John. Because it was John who caused the trouble, not Su Hong. The one who made the first move was also from John's side. Plus she had no feelings for John. And John didn't like her very much when he was with her. He thought she was pretty, and having such a girlfriend would make him look good. This is clear to both of them. In this case, she has no reason to intercede for John. Seeing that Wade didn't care about them, several security guards looked at each other, ready to step forward and take Wade away forcibly. They are not those high school students. It's not useful. Those who can be security guards must either be physically strong, or have some skills. These few guys, they don't believe please don't get out of Wade. As for calling the police, under normal circumstances they will not call the police. Because the police come here, it means trouble. There are many customers in the bar now, if the police come, ask them to turn off the music and tell them to let the people in the bar leave. Then they still do a fart business. But soon, there were a few more people lying on the ground. Advertisement. Just when Wade was about to make some amends, Su Hong made a sound. Wade, time to go. Okay, boss. Wade nodded. Why, what about the one you were eyeing just now? I've already called, and I'll call her later, so boss, I want to ask you for a vacation at night first. Wade said with a hay smile. Su Hong nodded. No problem, you can leave now. When I need you, I will find you. Then I'll go first, I wish you a good time, boss. Wade glanced at Kemira, gained some insight into Su Hong's taste. Kemira is beautiful and sexy, but in his opinion, his one is better. After all, Kemira is too thin, almost sensual. The atmosphere in the bar is a bit stuffy, do you want to go out for a drive with me? Do you have a car? Definitely, do I look like I can't drive a car? What car do you drive? Kemira seemed very interested in the car. The reason is simple, because her father opened a car repair shop. She has been repairing cars with his father since she was a child, and she knows cars very well. Her dream is to own a sports car of her own. Unfortunately, this dream is somewhat difficult to realize, because a good sports car doesn't come cheap. You can go out and see for yourself, maybe it's the type you like. Okay, then I'll go out with you to have a look. Kemira did not refuse Su Hong's invitation. After finishing speaking, she also glanced at John lying on the ground. John, I'm done with you. From now on, we break up. I think you are too childish and not my type. After speaking, Camilla walked out of the bar. As for whether doing so would offend John and make her look bad at school. She doesn't care. Because reading is not important to her. She is not at all reading material. Advertisement. Chapter 95, Definitely, Seeking Flowers, For More. Advertisement. After leaving the bar, the warmth on his face touched the cold air outside. Suddenly there is a kind of chill. Camilla suddenly felt a little cold. Just as she was thinking, a loose dress suddenly fell on her body. It is Su Hong. He didn't know when there was a lady's black long coat with sporadic embellishments on it. The clothes are beautiful, at least according to her aesthetic, very good. Also very high level. I think you should need this dress now, it's a little cold outside. At this moment, Myra suddenly understood what a heartbeat is. A man who cares about you, cares about you, will find your needs, is attentive and handsome, is really attractive. Also very heartwarming. When compared with her ex-boyfriend John, the removal is even more exciting. Where's your car? Camilla asked. Su Hong took out a car key and pressed it. In the distance, a silver supercar flicked on its headlights and honked. Camilla was stunned. Su Hong actually owns a silver sports car. She didn't recognize this sports car for a while. But as a professional car repair woman, even if she can't recognize the identity of the car, she can roughly estimate the price of the car. Because she knows how to configure. 
Want to go up and experience it? Can I? Kemura was stunned when she heard Su Hong's invitation. Even if you haven't experienced the performance of this car, you can tell that this car is definitely not an ordinary supercar after just a few glances. Definitely the top of the line car. Advertisement. The appearance is handsome, and the silver spray paint looks like a high-level spray paint, not cheap. The headlights and tires are also top-notch. Even before getting in the car to feel the performance of the car, she was already sure of one thing. This is a sports car that doesn't come cheap. The price, at least it won't be cheaper than that of her ex-boyfriend John. No, it should be said that John's car is completely incomparable with this one. Definitely. But what if I bump into something, or hit something, I can't afford it. Although Kemura really wanted to pull the car and sit in the cab, then step on the gas pedal for a wild ride. But she is very clear that the price of this car is very high, once she accidentally rubs it somewhere or touches it. She can't afford it at all. If you really hit something, you don't have to pay, because the car is insured, so you don't have to worry about it. You should go up and experience it now, I think you'll like it. Su Hong handed the key to Kemura. After a few seconds of hesitation, the latter still took the key, because she really couldn't refuse Su Hong's words. She really wanted to try driving a sports car and pull it to the fastest speed, what it felt like. Kemura is not in hesitation, directly towards the sports car doctor. Then he opened the driver's door and got in, and Su Hong sat in the co-pilot. Let me see how your driving skills are. Definitely yes, but I still don't know your name. Kemura finally asked Su Hong's name. You can call me Su. Su, my name is Camilla Baines, you can call me Camilla, that's what my friends call me. Kemura, okay, I see. Now, start the car and show me around. Actually, this is my first time in San Francisco. I'm not familiar with it. As a local, you maybe you can take me around, but I don't know if you have the time. Definitely, tomorrow is the weekend, our school is on holiday, and I don't have to go to school tomorrow. Kemura looked at Su Hong, her eyes widened. Su Hong smiled, but did not speak. After a few minutes, the pain in John's body finally eased. Advertisement. Knowing that Su Hong and Kemura had left, they didn't stop at the bar either. I lost all face in the bar today. John seemed to know what happened in the bar today, what went viral in school. Today, his face can be said to be completely lost. It's fine if your girlfriend is raped by someone, but you're also beaten up by someone from the other party. It's embarrassing to say it. He has already decided that the next time he sees Camila, that bitch will give her a good meal. Definitely, he won't be doing it himself. After all, Kemura is a woman and he is a man. If he does it himself, the people in the school will look down on him even more. But he can find someone. As a school bully, as a wealthy second generation who is fairly tall, there are not many women who like him in school. Just find those people to deal with Kamara's bitch. It's time to ruin Kemura's reputation. This is the price that bitch betrayed him. It was ringing like this. A silver sports car suddenly sped past them. The wind from the car blew up a cloud of smoke and dust, making them subconsciously cover their noses with their hands. Ask for flowers. But the next second, John froze. Because he just seemed to see that the person sitting in the driver's seat was Kemura's bitch. But it wasn't just him who saw it. The five people behind John saw it too. After all, the driver's window was not closed. Although the speed of the car just passing by was fast, this is an urban area after all. The speed is not so fast that only after images can be seen. So they all saw that it was Kemura sitting in the driver's seat. As for the silver sports car, although none of them knew it, as long as it was a sports car, there was no cheap one. Advertisement. And that sports car is so handsome, it is of a style they have never seen before, it must be a new supercar produced by a big car company. However, if it is linked to new products, the price will naturally not be cheap. Zero. And that car obviously couldn't be Camilla's. It could only be the Asian who left with her. Thinking of this, John gritted his teeth. No wonder that bitch of Kemura betrayed him, it turned out that he found someone richer. He already knew that Camila was a money-worshipping bitch, so why did he agree to her pursuit in the first place? He is really sick. John, the sports car that just drove past, the one in the driver's seat seems to be a Camilla, right? Some people just couldn't turn on which pot and lifted which pot, John felt his blood rushing up to his throat. Bob, don't talk nonsense, you are wrong, I didn't see any Camilla at all. Definitely, there are still smart people out there. I know this is not the time to say these words. John's situation looked bad already, just don't make him angry. Let's go. After a while, John's deep voice came. Everyone didn't leave any pot without opening it, but left with John. The other side. Kemera soon came to a deserted road. Then step on the accelerator straight to the bottom. The strong feeling of pushing back made her feel that her whole body was opened up. That kind of excitement was something she had never experienced before. From 0 to 200 km per hour, 3 seconds are useless. And this is not its fastest speed. She feels that the speed cannot be faster. Such terrifying performance made her understand this sports car. Absolutely the top of the line sports car. She didn't dare to think about the price at all. It is estimated that several million dollars would not be able to afford it, at least tens of millions of dollars would be worth five. Advertisement. Chapter 96, Can I Afford It Myself? Seeking Flowers, Five More. Advertisement. That night, Kemera did not go home. Definitely, no one would care if she didn't come home. 
because her father went to prison half a year ago, her current guardian is her second aunt. But her second aunt basically doesn't care about her, except for calling occasionally to ask about her situation. She basically doesn't appear in front of her on weekdays, and doesn't care if her grades are good or not. In a blink of an eye, three days passed. It's time for school to start again on Monday. Early in the morning, ordinary students either walk to school or ride a bicycle to school, and very few of them drive to school. And these very few belong to families with good conditions. After all, only those whose family conditions are good will provide their children with cars when they are still in high school. Studying in the Commonwealth is not cheap, especially going to university. Those prestigious universities, if you can't get a scholarship, then the high annual tuition fees are definitely enough for you to have a headache. Woo woo woo. Just then, a handsome silver supercar appeared at the end of the school road. In a roaring roar, the silver supercar drove towards the school gate. Definitely, after approaching the school gate, the speed of the sports car also slowed down. All the students passing by were attracted by this handsome silver supercar. Because this supercar is so beautiful and handsome. Even people who don't know cars will fall in love with this car at a glance, let alone those who know cars. Just by listening to the sound of the engine, you can know that this is a top supercar. It is definitely not affordable for ordinary people. But when he saw that sitting in the driver's seat was Kemera, a well-known high school girl in the city. Advertisement. Those who knew her were stunned. Those who were familiar with her were shocked. Because people who are familiar with her fell into the situation of her family. Definitely not a rich family. Not to mention this top-level supercar, even if it is an ordinary supercar, Kemera absolutely cannot afford it. But Kemera didn't care about the surprise and shock of these people. Instead, he drove the car, entered the school, and parked the car in the school's parking area. In federal colleges and universities, if students have the conditions, they can drive to school. Definitely, the premise is that you are of age and have a driver's license. At the school gate, 18-year-old Sam is still thinking about what car to buy next. Because his father promised him two months ago that as long as he turned 18, he would buy him a car. But he knew his father well and knew that he was not a generous person. It is estimated that even if you buy him a car, you won't buy any very good car. So recently he was wondering if there was any way to make some money. This way he can take it out when his father buys him a car, and then buy himself a better car. At least it will not be ridiculed when it is opened. Today's young people don't have a car to chase girls at school. He was 18 years old, and it was the time when youth hormones were flooding. Now he is like a male dog in heat. But if he didn't have a car, he wouldn't dare to chase those girls, because he wasn't tall or strong, and he couldn't be called handsome, he could only be called average. If he has a car, then it is definitely one of the advantages he can show. After all, there are not many people who can own a car in high school. Today, he came to school as usual. Of course, he also knew the school bell camera. After all, she was very famous in high schools in the city. But there are few boys who don't know her. Advertisement. There are also many discussions about her on weekdays. Everyone is discussing why she has such a good figure, whether she has a boyfriend, whether she has slept with a boyfriend or something. After all, for men, it is naturally women who talk the most when they are together. And Kemera, as the school bell, belongs to the top beauties in the school, so naturally there will be many people talking about her. But Sam never imagined that today he would see Camille driving a silver supercar to school. Doesn't it mean that her family's conditions are not good, isn't she a rich girl? Why did she drive a supercar to school today? And that supercar looks very expensive at first glance. Wild fantasies had begun in Sam's brain. For example, his goddess Kemera was maintained by a rich man, and the silver supercar was a gift from that rich man. Thinking of this, he was heartbroken. His goddess. Definitely, there are not many people who think like Sam. But none of this has anything to do with Kemera. After parking the car, Kemera walked directly to the classroom. But before she got to the classroom, she was stopped by several female students with unfriendly expressions. Seeing these female students, Kayla showed disdain. These people are no strangers to her, because she has seen John's dog-licking girl. Why they appear here, she has already guessed. It must be that John is not good at dealing with her by himself, so women like me deal with her. This made her disdain and disgust for John even stronger. I don't understand why I used that man John as a shield before. Why, John asked you to come. Camilla looked at the female students, not lying at all. It seems that you are not stupid, come with us, we have something to talk to you. The leading woman planned to go to La Camilla. Camilla didn't move. Advertisement. And before the woman was about to touch her, she spoke first, if you plan to drag me, I advise you to consider the cost of ruining my clothes first. The clothes on my body cost 23,000 US dollars, and the trousers, less, cost 14,000 US dollars. These are custom made, and if they break, they can only be thrown away. At that time, you may have to pay me tens of thousands of dollars. Also, don't you know what kind of car I drove to school today? Do you think I should buy a car like that by myself? Camilla is a smart woman. She knows where her strengths are. He also knows how to use his strengths. You say she betrayed John too fast, too unfeeling or something. She had no relationship with John originally. Originally, she used John as her boyfriend before, but she really meant to use him as a shield at first. But later on, she did think about having a good talk with John about boyfriend and girlfriend. But John looks good, but he is actually very stingy at 1.7.
with her, never willing to spend money. His car was not even willing to be driven by her once. The two are still just boyfriend and girlfriend. He is so stingy, how can she have a future with him? In fact, even without Su Hong, she would break up with John sooner or later. That's why she leaves in Sam's car in the movie. John didn't care about her as a girlfriend at all, even embarrassing her in front of his friends. Such a John is naturally not worthy of her cherishment. So she switched to Su Hong's arms without any pressure. At least Su Hong is generous enough to her, and compared to John, Su Hong is more handsome, mature, and stable. Definitely, he is rich enough and generous enough. And it was generous enough for her. Among rich people, people will not like it if they are tight-lipped. Advertisement. Chapter 97, Su Hong's Purpose, Seeking Flowers, One More. Advertisement. Several female students were taken aback by what Camilla said. The girl who stretched out her hand also paused in midair after hearing what Camilla said. Take a closer look at Camera's outfit today. The clothes are indeed beautiful. The upper body is a white shirt, and the lower body is a pair of slim black pants, which are decorated with many decorations. You can also see the exclusive LOOG belonging to the famous brand. They are all girls, even if they can't afford famous brand clothes, they have at least paid attention to them. After confirming that the clothes that Camera is wearing are indeed famous brands, which are very expensive, the girl didn't dare to grab Camera's clothes immediately. Because once Camera's clothes are damaged by her, she can't afford it. Tens of thousands of dollars is not a small amount. That's more than enough to buy a nice car. The family conditions of the few of them are also average, at most they are a well-off family. Tens of thousands of dollars are worth it, but it will definitely hurt your muscles and bones after you take it out. The main thing is whether it's worth it or not. And what Camila said just now, although they didn't see Camila driving a supercar to school, this woman definitely fell for some rich man. In the federal state, the most unaffected people are the rich. Because the federal state is a country controlled by capital, money is the most useful here. As long as you have money, you can really do whatever you want. They did come to Camilla because of John's words. But they are not small, not really brainless. Before doing something, you will also consider the consequences you will bear after doing it. To be honest, I don't understand that a man like John would be liked by a woman even at the age of 25. What benefit did he give you to let you help him like this? Could it be that if you help him deal with me, he will agree to be your boyfriend? Probably not. Camera said murderously. When the leading woman heard the words, her complexion turned blue and her face turned ugly. But in the end she didn't choose to do it, but snorted coldly. Then he left with a few female students behind him. They went in the direction of the school parking lot. Soon, they saw the silver supercar parked in the student parking area. Even if they don't know much about cars, when they see that car, their first impression is high-end, majestic, handsome, and must be very expensive. They also soon learned from other students that the car was indeed driven into the school by camera. After all, this sports car is too attractive. At that time, there were not many students seen at the school gate. Advertisement. You said something to each other, which opened up the matter of a top-level supercar coming to school. It has already spread throughout the school. She felt a little lucky at once, she just believed the words of Camila Nabichi. Unexpectedly, Baichi really found a rich man. Why is it called a rich man? Because ordinary people simply cannot afford such a car. Not to mention giving someone else a car like this to drive. A house is just needed, because everyone needs a house. The car is not, so it is more of a luxury accessory. For a real rich man, don't look at where he lives. It depends on what kind of car he drives. Because some people will be willing to spend tens of millions to buy a house, but he may not be willing to spend tens of millions to buy a car. The concepts of the two are different. And those who can afford to spend tens of millions to buy a car, that's the real top rich man. They can't afford to offend such a person. At the same time, in a villa that Su Hong just bought two days ago, Su Hong is fiddling with a pile of metals in his study room. This is the secondary adminium alloy and vibranium he purchased from the system. The price is not cheap. A kilogram of secondary adminium alloy costs 20 million US dollars, which is equivalent to 1 gram, 20,000 dollars. As for vibranium, the price of 1 kilogram is 30 million US dollars, which is equivalent to 30,000 US dollars per gram. Edmund alloy is more expensive, costing 60 million US dollars per kilogram. But for Su Hong, the inferior Edmund alloy is enough, after all, there is vibranium. The reason why he bought vibranium and secondary Edmund alloy was because Su Hong was considering whether to use his newly acquired ability, machine creator, to create a living mechanical armor for himself. And he also promised to design a new battlesuit for Wade before. Wade has performed well recently, and Su Hong is planning to get him a battlesuit. Just thinking about what kind of armor to design, the door was suddenly pushed open by Wade. Boss, people from CAI have come here, do you want to let them in? Outside the study, more than a dozen people were waiting. The leader is the director of the CIA, Miranda Akinishi. Miranda Josie is 54 years old this year, with half-white hair. He has worked in CAI for many years and has rich work experience. That's why he was sent here this time. Because the people who came to meet this time are not ordinary people. An old slick like him is needed. Three days ago, Su Hong and Deadpool took away the fire source in the 13th district, and the federal government was not ignorant. Because Su Hong just used telepathy ability to knock everyone unconscious. 
One did not kill anyone, and the other did not destroy the monitoring there. So what Su Hong and Deadpool did in the 13th district were all captured by the surveillance cameras in the 13th district. Advertisement. For three days, the federal government has been looking for the whereabouts of the two. After searching for three days, they finally found the whereabouts of Su Hong and Deadpool. Then Miranda Josie was sent over, and he was here to negotiate with Su Hong. Let them come in. As soon as Su Hong telepathy opened, he knew the purpose of the other party's visit, and then said directly, Su Hong didn't destroy the surveillance in the 13th district on purpose. If he really didn't want to expose the news, he wouldn't have deliberately left such a big hole. It was one of Su Hong's goals to let the other party take the initiative to find him. Doing so is somewhat similar to the apparition in the world of Resident Evil. The difference is that this time he doesn't intend to show his holiness, he only intends to make a high profile. And what he is thinking about now is to let the shape-shifting King Kong dig gold, not to do business with various countries in the world. Although that can also make a lot of money. But now even if it is a business of more than 10 trillion US dollars, Su Hong has already looked down upon it. He is still here now, just waiting for Tianzu and the others to come to Earth. And Megatron is in the 13th district, still being frozen. He can pick it up whenever he needs it. The reason for waiting for the shape-shifting King Kong to come to Earth. It was Su Hong who needed the shape-shifting King Kong data. Although he can create shape-shifting King Kong himself, he doesn't know where there is gold in the universe. And after obtaining the ability of the machine creator, Su Hong already knows shape-shifting King Kong very well. Shape-shifting King Kong is a metal mechanical life, and they have a special sense of metal. Where there is gold, if the distance is not far, they can sense it. But the premise is that you have to be not far from gold. Otherwise, if it is too far away, it will not be sensed. And although Su Hong can create the shape-shifting King Kong, let the shape-shifting King Kong he created run around all over the universe and dig for gold. When does he have to dig for gold, he can get a big harvest. Space travel is no joke. Who knows how big the entire universe is. The distance between planets is not short, let alone the distance between galaxies. And the shape-shifting King Kong mastered the space bridge technology. This is something that Su Hong has not mastered. If he has the skills, he can go whoring for nothing, and he doesn't mind waiting for a while. Wait until shape-shifting King Kong comes to Earth. Su Hong can directly control them, and then control various advanced technologies of Cybertron. Among them must include the technology of Space Bridge. At that time, I will buy a map of the distribution of gold in the universe, and let the shape-shifting King Kong fill the universe and open a space bridge to dig it. He can earn a lot of money in a short period of time. This is definitely more profitable than doing business with countries all over the world in the world of Resident Evil. Advertisement. Even the two are completely incomparable. After all, one is the resource of the Earth, and the other is the resource of the whole universe. But Su Hong couldn't be in a hurry for this matter at the moment. Because a map of the distribution of gold in the universe is really too expensive. The selling price is as high as 3 trillion US dollars. More expensive than an infinite gems. Even if Su Hong wanted to buy it now, he couldn't afford it at all. Definitely, he can first buy a small-scale gold distribution map and let the shape-shifting King Kong dig it. Make a small profit of 893 first. But this has to wait for Optimus Prime and the others to come to Earth and get the space bridge technology. Otherwise, let him personally use might and magic to send shape-shifting King Kong to dig gold all over the universe? As for preaching magic to others, not everyone can learn magic. Not everyone can cross an extremely long distance and open the magic door for ultra-long-distance teleportation. Not even the Sorcerer Supreme can do that. In comparison, the technology of Space Bridge can be fixed. You can also buy this technology from the system at a price of 20 trillion US dollars. Su Hong can afford it, and to him, it's not too expensive, but he doesn't think it's necessary for him to spend such a waste of money. After all, if you can go whoring for free, Tian is going to spend the money. At worst, just wait a while. Judging from the plot, Optimus Prime and the others are almost coming to Earth. As for the fact that Megatron is in the 13th district, does he have the technology of the space bridge in his hands? Su Hong never thought about it. Although Megatron is the leader of the Decepticons, whoever stipulates that the leader must be a scientist or a technician. The shape-shifting King Kong is a race, if they are divided into arms and jobs. Those who understand space bridge technology must also be technicians in shape-shifting King Kong. And Megatron is the leader shape-shifting King Kong, the leader of the Decepticons, and his ability is in waging war. In his hands, he might not be able to get the space bridge technology. But from Optimus Prime and Starscream, Su Hong can definitely get this technique. As for the natural enemies on the moon, Su Hong didn't think about it at all. That guy came to the Earth on the Ark spaceship, not the solar system by means of the space bridge technology. His Ark spacecraft may have wormhole jumping technology. But the spaceship wormhole jump is not suitable for the long-distance transmission of a large number of shape-shifting King Kong. After all, if Su Hong lets shape-shifting King Kong dig gold and send it out at one time, it will cost at least 100,000 shape-shifting King Kong as a base. Not the kind of tens or hundreds. So the space bridge technology is still needed. Advertisement. Chapter 98, You Can Call Me Mr. Su, Seeking Flowers, Two More. Advertisement. Outside, Miranda Josie looked calm, but the people behind him were a little restless. There was some worry on his face. 
As for what to worry about, it was naturally worried that Su Hong would not see them. But Melin knew very well that if Su Hong didn't want to see them, they wouldn't even be able to see the surveillance video. The other party deliberately did not destroy the cameras in the 13th district. The purpose is to let them take the initiative to come to the door. So Miranda didn't panic at all. Sure enough, Wade came out again shortly after entering. The boss let you in. Thank you very much. Moran said politely. You're welcome. You just said that you are the director of the CIA, so you must have great authority in the CIA. Do me a little favor. I've been chasing a girl recently, but she has no interest in me. I want you to help me find out what hobbies she has. Meland. Do you have a picture of her? Miranda didn't want to agree, but thinking that Deadpool is Su Hong's man, he didn't reject him. Definitely got it. Deadpool pulled out a photo. After seeing the photos, the Rand people were even more stunned. He gave Wade a weird look. The woman in the photo looks at least 30 years old. Her face can only be regarded as okay, but her figure is not bad. Originally thought that Wade fell in love with some beautiful woman and wanted to pursue her, so he asked him for help. He didn't expect that the woman he wanted to pursue was so ordinary, he was a little speechless. Daisy, Melinda called. Behind him, a young woman in her 20s responded. Advertisement. She is from the CIA Intelligence Department, a 22-year-old blonde woman with a small suit on her upper body and a light gray hip-wrapped skirt with black silk on her lower body. The black stockings wrapped her slender thighs, which was very eye-catching. Definitely, she is also very smart. She graduated from Columbia University and was able to enter the CIA Intelligence Department because of her ability, not her appearance. Her appearance is just smallpox anew. Definitely, following this time, she is mainly here to be a vase. Because they don't know much about Su Hong. The only thing they know is that Su Hong contacted Chimera three days ago. He also gave her a silver top supercar. That's why Daisy is here. She is also the only woman among Miranda and his group. Director Dot. The photo is for you. After this incident, you can deal with it. Daisy didn't speak, just took the photo. She glanced down at the woman in the photo, and found that Deadpool seemed to have no interest in her, and she immediately felt Moran's mood before. Surprised and speechless for Deadpool's wonderful aesthetic. After being speechless, Daisy collected the photos. Wade didn't say anything. Give them the way in, let them in. Myland and others went in. He saw Su Hong in the room at a glance. All eyes fell on Su Hong. Carefully looked at. Those who came here have all seen the video of District 13. He knew that Su Hong sitting there was not an ordinary person. Not only did Su Hong take away the fire source Rubik's Cube that was originally placed in the 13th district by unknown means, but also the aurora that appeared in the sky for 8 hours 3 days ago was probably made by Su Hong. This also exists, you can say that his gods are also fine. Because humans simply cannot do such things. Advertisement. Definitely, they suspect that neither Su Hong nor Wade are from Earth. But aliens. Because the Rubik's Cube of the fire seed source is not something that belongs to the Earth. A long time ago, some scientists suspected that this was something from aliens. Sooner or later the aliens will be found. But now Su Hong not only found it. He took away the fire seed source Rubik's Cube with ease, obviously because he was familiar with that thing. This made the top officials of the federal government doubt whether Su Hong would be the owner of the Rubik's Cube. Just sit as you please. Su Hong's voice sounded. But none of Myland and the others went to sit. Sir, I don't know how to address it. It was Myland who spoke. He is the main person in charge of this mission. Others followed, more to cooperate with him. You can call me Mr. Su. Mr. Su. Excuse me, is Mr. Su a native of Earth? Myland was taken aback for a moment. Such a title is a bit similar to that of Daxia. But the problem is that they guessed that Su Hong's identity is an alien. As for his Asian appearance, it seemed to them more like an image he had become, not what he was. Definitely, when did I say I'm not from Earth anymore? Su Hong asked back. Sorry, I didn't mean that, I just had some accidents. Miranda apologized quickly, as if he was afraid that what he said just now would make Su Hong unhappy. No need to apologize, in fact, I know your purpose, because I know what you are thinking. I am not an alien as you think, I am a person from the Earth, definitely not from your Earth. You can understand that my men and I come from the Earth of other parallel universes. As for my ability, it's even more powerful than you imagined. Although I dare not say omnipotent, it's almost there. You can treat me as a living god. Advertisement. The fire seed source Rubik's Cube is impossible to return to you. Although this thing does not belong to me, I am more suitable to own it than you, because you can't grasp it. The robot in your base is only three. He belongs to a mechanical race. This race has a planet ten times larger than Earth. There are as many robots on it as there are people on Earth. Sooner or later, they will find the Earth and start a war on the Earth. I took away the fire source, and for you, it actually helped you. I have a list here, you can take it back and give it to the people behind you. I have everything on it, as long as you can pay the corresponding amount of money, I can sell it to you. Make a deal with you. While Su Hong was speaking, a large stack of documents floated up out of thin air and flew towards Miranda. It was a product list listed by Su Hong. The above things are basically the things he sold in the world of Resident Evil. Most of them are various technologies, Zhao Zhao. It belongs to the black technology level. It was sold in the world of Resident Evil before. He prostituted a technology for nothing. 
Now that he has all these technologies in his hands, he can completely sell them once and continue to sell them in the future. It is a journal without a copy. As long as one copy is sold, the profit is pure profit. Su Hong's words revealed a lot of information. Miranda still looks calm on the surface, but his heart is already like a stormy sea, and it is difficult to calm down. Because the information exposed by Su Hong, once released outside, is enough to shake the whole world. Especially after he hastily glanced at the things on the stack of documents that flew over. He understood what the meeting with Su Hong this time meant. I also understand Su Hong why I left the camera on purpose. Compared with it, a large stack of materials flying up out of thin air and flying in front of you is nothing. After all, he had seen the footage of Su Hong sitting in the 13th district captured by the cameras in the 13th district. Advertisement. Chapter 99, Sam Witwicky, Seeking Flowers, Three More. Advertisement. In a blink of an eye, another three days passed. The whole school knows about Michaela's love affair with the rich man. Countless people who liked and secretly loved her were heartbroken. After all, their goddess already belonged to someone else. Just thinking about that scene makes me feel uncomfortable. Sam is one of them. He didn't know why, obviously he hadn't seen Kemera a few times. But every time he saw the youthful, beautiful, and very beautiful Kemera in school, he would feel uncomfortable. Such a beautiful woman, I don't know who is cheap. Definitely, uncomfortable is uncomfortable. He was going to buy a car soon, and he began to worry about where he could get a sum of money. But he is a high school student, and he has no means of making money at all, so he can't go to robbery, he doesn't have the physique and courage. One day ago, he suddenly remembered a pair of glasses left by his great-great-great-grandfather. That thing is more than a hundred years old now, it's an antique anyway. And his great-great-great-grandfather was sent to a mental hospital in his later years though. But he was also a famous person when he was young, maybe someone is interested in the glasses he once wore. If it is sold, no matter how much it is, it will be some money. When it comes time to buy a car, if his dad spends a little more, he can buy a slightly smaller military car. 923. In this way, driving out also saves some face in front of friends. Boys of their age often value face more than anything else. Just thinking about it, Sam suddenly felt someone walking in front of him. Blocked the sun. Sitting on the grass, Sam, who was cleaning his grandfather's glasses and was going to sell in class today, raised his head. He first saw a pair of straight and slender big white legs. Advertisement. The speaker was a young girl with blonde hair. Very beautiful, in Sam's opinion, not much worse than Kemera. The girl is wearing a denim wrap-around skirt. From his angle, if he is a little lower, he may be able to see the mysterious triangle. Sam thought wretchedly. He was suddenly a little angry at himself for not being a child. The girl's legs are very white. She is definitely the whitest woman he has ever seen. Even Europeans are generally white. But it is rare to see a girl so white. There is a hint of tenderness in the white skin, like a piece of beautiful jade, which makes people want to reach out and touch it. When Sam looked at her, she looked at Sam. Are you Sam Witwicky? Sam froze for a moment. Then came the tension. The other party asked his name, and it was obviously aimed at him. This made Sam slightly excited. Could it be that his luck is coming? Ah, that, what, I'm Sam Witwicky. If you're looking for Sam Witwicky, I'm sure I'm the only Sam Witwicky in our school. Sam was a little excited. There was even some difficulty in speaking. It's just you, come with me. Someone wants to see you? Huh. Sam was taken aback. No, isn't this beauty looking for me? But from the current situation, this beauty is a messenger. The other party didn't come to him on purpose. This made him a little disappointed when he thought that the peach blossoms had arrived. I was completely happy just now. Advertisement. Definitely, he also wondered in his heart, who was looking for him. Following the pretty woman, Sam soon came to the school's principal's office. Sam is very puzzled, is it the principal who wants to see him? But he is just an ordinary high school student, why does the principal see him? Walking into the principal's office, he saw the principal in his 60s standing in the office. Talk to an Asian guy who looks like he's in his 20s. And that man was sitting where the school should sit. This made him even more suspicious. Have no idea what's going on here. Mr. Sue, someone is here. Daisy did not forget to say when she brought Sam into the office. It turned out that the blonde beauty who went to find Sam was none other than Daisy from the CIA. Definitely, this was her previous identity, and now, she has become, CFFD, Su Hong's personal secretary. Responsible for helping Su Hong with some minor matters. In Su Hong's villa that day, when Miranda and the others left, Daisy didn't leave with them. Instead they stayed. One thing is that Daisy is beautiful, and another thing is that Su Hong really needs someone who can help him with some things. Daisy is a graduate of Columbia University's Department of Information Management. He is a proper high-achieving student. Being Su Hong's secretary is completely qualified. And she's pretty enough to be a good eye-catcher too. Su Hong is not the kind of person who can't walk without seeing a woman. The reason why I like Kimura is entirely because she is the heroine of shape-shifting King Kong. Su Hong was once amazed by her when he first watched the movie. Her identity gave her a lot of points, plus she was indeed beautiful, and Su Hong did have some needs. Su Hong, who had nothing to do, just dated her. As for the arrival of Daisy with Sam, Su Hong naturally knew about it. Advertisement. But Erwin, the principal of the high school in the city, didn't know. Daisy's voice was more to remind him. 
Mr. Su, since the person you are looking for is here, I will leave first and not disturb you, Erwin said with a smile. Then he left the office directly. As for why he was so polite to Su Hong, it is because this high school in the city has been fully acquired by Su Hong. Simply put, this high school is now Su Hong's property, and he is the one who works for Su Hong. If he wants to continue to be the headmaster here, Su Hong is naturally necessary. Erwin smiled at Sam as he left. Only then did I leave the office. When Erwin left the office, Su Hong and the three of them were left in the room immediately. Sam with which? Yes, yes, sir. Sam was a little nervous. A person who even the headmaster would politely apologize for laughing, knows without thinking that it must be a big shot. Don't be nervous, I have no ill intentions towards you. This time, I just want to buy a pair of glasses from you that your great-great-great-grandfather -great wore. That pair of glasses is in your hands. Sam froze for a moment. Because it is reasonable to say that Su Hong should not know about this matter. After all, this is a decision he just made, and he hasn't told outsiders yet. But how did Su Hong know? But doubts turned into doubts, knowing that Su Hong was going to buy his great-great-great-grandfather's pair of glasses, he was more excited and happy. Because he had already guessed that Su Hong's identity was not simple, at least he was a rich man. If the other party wants to buy his great-great-great-grandfather's glasses, he may be able to sell them for a good price. I dare not say too much, he is satisfied if he can sell several thousand dollars. This has allowed him to take it out when his father bought him a car and buy himself a better car. Definitely, it would be even better if it could sell a little more. Advertisement. Chapter 100, Excited Sam, Asking for Flowers, Four More. Advertisement. Yes, yes, sir, my great-great-great-grandfather was once a great adventurer. Many of his deeds can be found in previous books. He is definitely a great adventurer. The glasses he has worn are definitely collectible. If you want to buy my great-great-great-grandfather's glasses, I can give you a suitable price. Then what price do you think is right? Su Hong looked at Sam and asked anxiously. Speaking of which, I can be regarded as greening him in advance, after all, he cut off his future girlfriend Kemera Dash. And because of his appearance, his fantasy experience will also change accordingly. Without the Autobots entering his life, his future should be as ordinary as most people. Definitely, Su Hong would not think that he owed Sam anything because he did something wrong. This time I came to Sam, just to buy the pair of glasses. Glasses are not very important to Su Hong. Belongs to dispensable kind. No, he could also spot the Autobots as soon as they landed on Earth. If so, the Autobots would take the initiative to look for him after they landed on Earth. Because if they want to find the source of fire, they will need this pair of glasses. Glasses are just an introduction. Dispensable to Su Hong. It's just that he is a little bored now, and he plans to find something for himself to do. As for the deal with the Federation, those guys are still discussing what to buy from Su Hong, and they probably won't be able to negotiate anything in a short time. After all, the federal state is not entirely up to the president. The Senate and House of Representatives are also equally powerful. It is estimated that it will take at least half a month for them to come to an agreement. But Su Hong doesn't care about these businesses. Because mining gold is his big business. Advertisement. Me? I think it's up to you to set the price. After all, I don't know much about the prices of such things. However, my great-great-great-grandfather's glasses are really suitable for collection. If the price is too low, it's not so good. Sam hinted to Su Hong. He certainly couldn't set the price himself. What if the price he offered was too high and Su Hong didn't buy it? Drive too low, and he dies again. And if Su Hong comes to open it, if the price is high enough and he is satisfied, he can directly deal with it. If it is low, he can bargain for a little more. Although he was nervous, it was related to the money he would pay for the car in the future, so he still tried his best to get a little more money. Su Hong could guess what was going on in Sam's mind even if he didn't turn on telepathy. Don't you just want to sell more money? Sam almost had his thoughts written all over his face. Then $100,000. Su Hong finally gave a price. It's not that kindness is big, people are stupid and have a lot of money. But to him, $100,000 is not considered money at all. If there is $100,000 in cash on the ground in front of him, he will at most take a look at it instead of bending down to pick it up. He is not short of money, if he is stingy in this kind of matter, it will appear that he has no style. He is not short of this little money, why bother to lower his style actively? $100,000? Did I hear correctly, sir, you said you would spend $100,000 to buy my great-great-great-grandfather's glasses. Sam was stunned. He even thought for a while that he had heard wrong. That's $100,000. It's nothing to Su Hong. But for him, it is definitely a big sum. Although their family is a well-off family, they can spend $100,000. But after taking out so much money, their family's savings will definitely almost bottom out, which is the kind that hurts muscles and bones. Advertisement. It is absolutely impossible for his father to buy him a car for $100,000. Spend up to $10,000 to buy him a car. But in fact, in the movie, his father only spent a few thousand dollars to pick out a tattered Chevrolet sports car, Bumblebee, for him in 10 second-hand car markets. That's why he was so shocked when he heard Su Hong's asking price of $100,000. Because so much money is definitely a huge sum of money to him. His father can earn this much money without eating or drinking for two or three years. And now he sold a pair of glasses that no one wanted. 
How could he not be excited, not shocked? Definitely, I'm talking tens of millions of dollars. Why, is the price low? No, it's unbelievable to me. You really are the nicest, most generous person in the world. Sam was very excited by Su Hong's generosity. He even started to praise Su Hong's generosity. This may be the charm of money. Daisy, go get a hundred thousand dollars in cash from my car. Ask for flowers. And Mr. Sam, where are your great-great-great-grandfather's glasses? I have it with me. I can give it to you right now. In fact I was wiping it when this beautiful lady came to me. Sam quickly took out the glasses and handed them to Su Hong. And Daisy left the office to get money for Sam. After a while, Daisy returned with a black bag. In the bag is a green dollar bill measuring one. There are ten stacks in total, a stack of one hundred dollar bills with a denomination of one hundred. Just over one hundred thousand. Advertisement. When Daisy came back, she gave the money directly to Sam. The latter took the money excitedly. He wanted to count the amount face to face, but he was a little worried that doing so would make Su Hong angry. Because this is an act of distrust towards Su Hong. I got the glasses, the transaction has been completed, Sam, if you have nothing else to do, you can go. Okay, sir, thank you again for your generosity. After Sam finished speaking, he left excitedly. Even Daisy didn't take a second look. It's not that he's not interested in beautiful women. His original intention of buying a good car was to find a beautiful girlfriend. And Daisy is undoubtedly a top-notch beauty. If such a beautiful woman were to be his girlfriend, he would wake up laughing from his dreams. But it's obviously not possible for the two of them. In this case, Daisy is not as attractive as the $100,000 in the bag. After all, Daisy does not belong to him, but the $100,000 in the bag belongs to him. Su Hong glanced at the glasses on the table. With this pair of glasses in his hand, the next thing to do was to wait for the Autobots and Decepticons to descend on the earth before he could start his plan. On the other side, Sam took the money from Su Hong. After leaving the principal's office, then I hurried back to the classroom, put the money in my school bag and went to ask the teacher for leave. He plans to skip class today and go straight to buy a car. Now that he has $100,000, he can buy a car by himself. Moreover, he carried the money with him, and he didn't worry about where he put it. He planned to spend it directly and buy a car directly. He didn't need his father to buy it for him. $100,000 is enough for him to buy a good car, even a poor sports car, he can afford five. Advertisement.